Um, this video I found is nothing to do with corn. This is about uh, a guy who does his own catch a predator stings, <laughs> but he also, because it's low rent, I guess, is his, also his own decoy. So he shows you here <laughs> how he does the voices for them. Let's get into it. Hit play, please. Guy is pretending to be a young girl to lure potential <laughs> online predators. But as Stephen Fabian reports, law enforcement is getting increasingly frustrated when private <laughs> citizens go on the prowl for predators. That's so funny. Beefy for Dude, what a guy. <laughs> okay. It's the only reason, by the way, that's true. They do get shitty with that. It's the only reason we didn't. On Legion of Skanks, we were going to do uh, a sting operation. Was we were going to set up our own to catch a predator, but everyone that came out to confirm was going to be dressed as Sting from like <laughs> trench coats and the white thing yeah, and baseball right. bats. So we were going to be we're going to be like eight Stings coming out on a Sting operation. It's a Sting Sting. <laughs> That's great. That's really great. And, yeah. then one, and then one of you guys has to be early '90s Sting with like the like yellow <laughs> yeah, the and purple the scorpion on the side. And then you have the marching band jacket. <laughs> and they just have one person dressed like like musician Sting as well. <laughs> <laughs> just, yeah. just every possible kind of Sting. Yeah. He's, he's just playing like. I'm an alien. I'm a legal yeah. alien. We throw an awkward one in when we have uh, what was it, Jack Lemon and fucking uh, is it Jack Lemon? Who's the Sting? The original <laughs> Sting, Jackie Gleason. No, that's uh, the hustler. It's like Robert Redford and uh, fucking Paul Newman. Robert probably. Shaw. Jackie right. Gleason wasn't the Sting. No, he, I think he was, but it wasn't. You know, the, they weren't the main two guys. The main two guys, I think, were Robert Redford and Paul Newman. Paul Newman yeah. Oh, okay. So, yeah, we go that deep cut reference also. I hope it hits as hard as it did here. <laughs> I, uh, well, I can only hope. That's not Jackie Gleason? I, uh, <coughs> it's not. It's clearly not. I get it already. Um, so let's go back to the video. This guy is <laughs> it's sort of a tail tuck. Just go back to the This guy is video. yoked, too. Yeah, no, he's he must be on tons. that prednisone. <laughs> yeah, he's just taking cycles. Oh, this guy must be on pred. <laughs> Pedophile This Batman. guy must be on PZ. <laughs> This beefy 40-year-old man is pretending beefy. to be a teenager. Hey, what's up? How are you? It's Jennifer. Shane Coyle is talking Dude, like that is so beefy. fucking... Bring that back. That is so fucking funny. I love old dick. Yeah. <laughs> um, right now, I'm usually doing sets of three of three for, you know, power, less for define. It's all meathead shit. I'm just working on my traps. Um, you know, I'm doing like a little bit of CrossFit, mostly hard work, weight, or weight work. Are you sure you're underage? You sound like Michelle Wolf. <laughs> Actually, I am. I'm running at you. <coughs> hey, what's up? How are you? It's Jennifer. Shane Coyle is talking like a girl to entice predators. Whatever he says, that when he he does it. He yeah. doesn't fle face inflections when he's doing it. Also, he's doing a lot of face stuff. <laughs> yeah. dude, and then, he, but at the end of it, he looks at the guy who's like interviewing him, and he's like, he's like, don't make it weird, dude. Look, look at his finger at the very dude, end. He's of that. Meisner, bro. It's Meisner technique. Go back, Christine. In the car, right there. He's doing. Look at the end of him doing. Time. I'm Jennifer, and look at him. Look at the guy. Like, just don't make me do any more, dude. Watch. What's up? How are you? It's Jennifer. Shane Coyle is talking like a girl to entice. <laughs> See, he goes, this isn't. He goes, I'm not gay. Or no, I. <laughs> Because, you know, I'm not fucking yeah, weird. I'm not weird. That's what you're saying. Yo, bro, my, gro my girlfriend's so hot. <laughs> yeah. Dude, I get so much ass. Dude, like, you don't even fucking know. He's like, no, bro, you don't even fucking know. Yo, I fucking collect those predator heads like fucking trophies, bro. <laughs> yo, yo, I got a necklace of fucking predator ears. <laughs> fucking girlfriend. Predator, predator ears. All of this sounds so much cooler than it is. <laughs> the green blood and everything? Nah. Nah, like sad dudes that live with them now. <laughs> yeah. You know. Retarded kids, they're yeah. just above teenagers. Most, you gotta fuck they teenagers. were molested, and yeah. in turn molest somebody else. It's like vampires, <laughs> but like you know, with older men sucking younger men's dicks. I hope he does the. Uh, I hope he does the actual stings. We're gonna look into who this guy is, and. Uh, well, but I hope when he does his things, he does the uh, South Park detective guy. Oh, he, goes, nice. he goes through with no, he goes through with the entire sexual act. And they arrest him for that. Yeah, baby, that was a lot of cum. <laughs> <Hey, laughs> yeah, no, that's what he goes. I'm a cop. <laughs> so God South Park funny, is so dude. funny. He goes, dude, when they're pulling him out of the frat house, it's always and he freeze. Goes, I want to take all of them. He goes, I'm a cop. <laughs> dude, it's so goddamn funny. Free. Wow, baby, that was a lot of cum. Dude, when he falls in love with the pimp, <laughs> let me just go oh, yeah. over. Yeah, he goes, at the, the end. baddest bitch in all the den. He goes, you say the greatest things. <laughs> <laughs> and then at the end, he goes, I'm a cat. Yeah. Eating for sex. He showed me how he does it. Okay, cool. So, where do you want to meet? All right, yeah, I know where that is. He's taking I a bet you, I bet you $7,000. 
that this guy has a history. He tried stand-up comedy before. 100%. Oh, yeah. I also oh, yeah. bet he was mid-set when he discovered he could make this voice. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> like when he hit the he note. Was, the, crowd, the crowd was like, that's awesome. Like, and he's like, ah! <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Yes, Look at this girl in the front row is all like, I'm kidding. I you like, you start, yeah, he's like, oh, oh, oh all right. Oh, oh. Oh, maybe I can be a crime fighter. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, no, I mean, the sky's the limit, huh? Uh, First time doing comedy? Look at this. Yeah, maybe I am Batman. <laughs> <laughs> Look what happened when he says an alleged predator tried to run him down when he realized it was a sting. Hey, run me over, boy. Go ahead, come on. <laughs> Why is he running ahead? It. Yeah. Come on, what are you gonna do? You gonna hit me? Hit me? Come on, what are you gonna do? Come on. You think I'm afraid of you and your pervert car? Your <laughs> car's a pervert, huh? You probably only use underage gas. <laughs> what you fucking mean? Hey, is that the statutory mobile? Huh? What is that? Huh? Is that what you fuck your kids? Huh? Go take a run of me. Go take a run You're of fucking, me. You should be ashamed of yourself, a 45 year old man yeah. driving a Geo Tracker. Oh, what out are here. you doing? Are you fucking kids in a rap for? <laughs> it's always like kid. <laughs> Cars. What are you trying to do? You're buying kids and you dodge neon. You might bring it on. I'll what take you right on it. Hey, you fucking teenage boys and your Jetta. <laughs> Volkswagen <laughs> rabbit. <laughs> Howling for predators. Hey, she told me she was 21. This startled me. <laughs> so funny. Dude. That could be a better so shirt. Funny. So, so this funny. is a guy he's catching. Who uh, looks like he, he goes, looks like his fucking uh, his mustache came with his beard <laughs> in a bag? <laughs> so funny. At least, he's, at least he's raising awareness for breast cancer research. <laughs> is that what it is? Yeah, it's, it's, it's got to be no, pink, no, right? It's got to be. He goes, dude, you're gonna shit. I am a manager at Michaels. Uh, <laughs> I gotta get back. Here. Yeah, this is. I thought you was 21. You'll be cool. Right? I've learned. I like when they always try to. They do this on To Catch a Predator too, and they just in the early ones before they knew it was TV. They go, well, I have learned my lesson. I appreciate the talk. <laughs> and, uh, he, goes, so, he goes, so I do promise I will not do, like, lesson. Like, look, look, look at this shit that can go down. Damn, I'm out of here. You guys have been fantastic, though. He goes, good job, good job. You know what? You affected one life today. Yeah. <laughs> this guy's. Oh, my God. You know what, sir? I want to shake your hand for correcting my sale. And you go outside and you get fucking Billy Club in the leg and a guy tases you. And they let a dog start biting your arm. <laughs> ah! Also, we're leading with your on the episode after the Super Bowl. You know, like, oh, are you hmm? fucking kidding me? What's up? They go, yeah, no, we're going to heavily promote it during the halftime show. Mm. Justin Timberlake's doing a sh- uh, song called Stop Perverts. <laughs> they get him to sign the release by yeah. saying it won't air. Yeah. He goes, how are you guys going to show on the Titan Tron? He goes, no, no, we have, you know, the audience we live on the field, they're all holding a giant sheet. We're projecting yeah. it straight down onto that. It's pretty crazy. It's going to be the largest projection ever. First ever projection visible from space. It's crazy. It's crazy. We're actually going to take a shot of it from space. It should be your face. And that is all you, dude. So, anyways. I bought the time. <laughs> yeah. Sorry you didn't you get You did that. the work, though. Sorry you didn't get that sweet meat. we got to put you in the back of the back car. Back up to the beginning of it, because he this guy really tries to... Here's the thing. You do have to assess. When you when you realize you're being stinged by a fucking guy, just some dude... I'm just thinking about Part of you, start, you do have to start going like the... It is important that this guy is like a lunkhead, meathead dude, because yeah, yeah. you do have to make a do decision. I have to find you're like, my way out. Like, if this guy, is it just you? He goes, the cops are waiting outside, right? He goes, nah, just me, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that changes everything. He goes, I, I can beat the shit. He goes, he goes You'll try, I'll try to fight that guy and smash that camera. Yeah, he goes like this. He goes, yeah, you just ran into the one guy that knows that you're a pervert. You go, you wearing a wire or anything? Goes, it's no. called solopervstoppers.com. <laughs> I'm the only one, and my family doesn't know what I do. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so. Nobody knows where I'm at. I am unaccounted for. I left- no one will be looking for me till next month. Till next month. I haven't let <laughs> anybody sh- know where I am. Yeah. Until <laughs> these streets are cleaned up. I said I was going to the Mayan ruins for some sort of a scientific adventure. Goes, I, I told it. people that so nobody would know I was in town goes, and the predators would come out. He goes, I faked my own death and took the insurance money in order to buy My them. mother, God bless, is in tears as we speak. She thinks a little baby boy's dead. She doesn't know a little baby boy is now Jennifer. I came to my own funeral on a mustache. I could broke my heart to see my mom like that. But I gotta stop, you fucks. Goes, she couldn't leave the house for two weeks <laughs> but you know who left the house all those predators <laughs> <laughs> she told my brother jimmy she wishes it was him in that coffin there he goes he's a special boy <laughs> the family's all falling apart because of you you scumbag i gotta be here <laughs> <laughs> the only thing that stands between you and a life in prison 
It's just me <laughs> with with light to no fighting skills. You, oh, you get in your car? I'll fight your fucking car. No, I'll, fight you. I'll punch your headlight. He fucking takes a hit from the car. All right. Let's... Howling for predators. Hey, she told me she was 21. This startled man in Arizona thought he was meeting a 13-year-old girl for sex. Can I just please walk away and I'll never do this again? Instead, he's confronted yeah. by a six-foot, 300-pound <laughs> truck driver, Anthony Green. The predators think they're going to meet a child. Instead, they meet me. Based on this video... Am I going to jail? Matthew Sanchez was sentenced to five years in prison. Green says his hey. undercover... I hope the trucker guy fucks them. <laughs> yeah. That's his punishment. He goes, look, I gotta fucking get this haul of brute out to fucking Nevada by tomorrow. So I don't got time to take you through all the paperwork yes. and red tape. I'm gonna fuck you and assume you learned your lesson. He goes, let me take your picture. Now nah, you got two options. Because I'm not going to lie, you're fucking me on this transpo right now. <laughs> I can stuff you up nice with this big old fat... Oh, you know he's got a fat, thick one, too. Here, here's the deal. You give me a two-handed job. <laughs> I'll let you back out in the wild. I'm a catch and release guy. I'm number 19 on the showers. So yeah. if you got it in you, I'll take you to Denny's for a spin. He goes, we'll get you... You top me off. Dude, so this isn't this isn't just one guy. I hope to God this guy this is also doing. He's, I think he must be he must be doing talk to text because there's no. I don't. I want to see this guy go. So you know, fuck these pieces of shits. What we do? I'm Jennifer, and I'm gonna suck your wiener. The only thing I love more than catching predators is Aaron Rodgers. <laughs> yeah, goes, I the best thing about my parents not being home is it makes me so horny. Do you know if you have a big old man penis for my little pussy? That's the way I do it though, where they still saying guy words. Yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? Stuff your fat cock <laughs> <up> in, <my, laughs> in my shitter. Or, <laughs> or because he's a truck driver, he just gets fucking into traffic and he goes, What's your 20? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He goes like this. He goes, I'm a real lot lizard. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, a term. He goes, He's just driving. So you're going to come she meet goes, me? Roger what's a, that. Uh, I'm only 23 years old. What's a lot lizard, sweetheart? I'm going to this. You know, we need a long haul truck and 18 wheelers. You know. <laughs> Just when you pull up to the dock a lot of times, there's some day workers who will help you with your unload. But I'm hauling pretty heavy this week, baby. I'm, I'm horny. I'm so horny. I'm open like Interstate 40 between March and May. He's like, what? That's very specific. 10-4, good buddy. <laughs> I got some mud on my flaps. Over. 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 <laughs> I'm so wet for you. Over. <laughs> <laughs> 20 arrest. Coyle says he's exposed. <laughs> he's never got this guy not fucking in his used car lot fucking day job talking. He goes, I do these to move Pontiac Sun Fires as well. He goes, I catch predators that think they're fucking a retarded little kid. Yeah. 70 child predators. So what do the police, what do law enforcement say about what you're doing? They don't support it. They don't <laughs> believe it's going to be any justice. They've never believed in my acting abilities. <laughs> just, I've been contacted yeah. by some low-level voiceover uh, agents. He goes, but this gets me sag after, so thank you, Inside Edition. <laughs> this is it. This is the credit if I pay the dues. He goes, uh, you know, I have been told by police to... Stay away. I uh, <laughs> I did my two freebies. It was a Halls commercial and a little thing on the Metro Channel. Anyways, watch New York One. <laughs> they believe that it's hindering cases out there. Inside Edition security expert Steve Cardian <laughs> agrees. This guy There's definitely a hates it. Department in this country that advocates this kind of activity. They don't know the rule of Talk law. About they a don't guy know holding under his hair. What are you doing? <laughs> yeah. Everybody knows the rule. Yeah, that's a real definitive line what for a, just like a little bit of hair. He has a hawk from Road Warriors hair. Yeah, dude. No, he's got dew. <laughs> he's like dew settling on the fucking on your car. <laughs> he's, he's got, got frost. He's got, he's got frosty he's got night. Frost. Yeah. He's, he's got, got morning. <laughs> he's got autumn <laughs> frost. <laughs> 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 your car was warm, but the outside's kind of icky, and it just makes that happen. Because you have to wait until your windows unthaw. You yeah. know what I'm talking about? You can really take a hunk of it off. Yeah. Why would you hold on to your hair at that point? I don't know, but I tell this guy, it's not like... I like my guy goes, these guys don't know the rule of law. In some cities, you can do this. Goes, <laughs> you can fuck children. It's crazy. 
So they don't know what a prosecutor needs. Hello, I'll surprise you. I'm very real. <laughs> well, some of us. Can we find that guy? a real person? Yeah. <laughs> Just, I exist, so I completely exist. Yeah. What do you mean? I want you to come over here and put your penis in my pussy. Yeah. Just really pound my puss out. Yeah. Well, listen, baby, the Vikings are the late game, and they're giving five. <laughs> I'm really horny. Do right. you get me a sixer of Keystone? Yeah. <laughs> <I don't... laughs> the things they ask you, know, they always ask to bring over, like, fast food and whatever yeah. and condoms. It's just asking for adult things. Can you bring me over a couple of quarts of 10W30? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I could use some SOS scrubs. <laughs> Just fucking goshies. Do you know, is there a place near that sells chaw? I can't get it in my town. Can you bring me a W9 form, maybe? A skull long cut? <laughs> this is the guy. His name's Shane Coyle. Shane yes. Coyle. Mick Coyle. <laughs> my goodness. Okay, perfect. I'll tell you what. It seems like every time... I get in my car and I set up my damn Wi-Fi. Is he listening to Cascade? Yeah, what is this guy? Getting? I listen to K-pop and talk to a sexual rat, sexual molesters all day. He goes, you know what? This guy's definitely killed a child <laughs> after he fucked it. He goes, do you know what predators don't like? A guy who's constantly moving. You can see from the back seat of my car, he, I'm always in transit. Yeah, he admits to one friend that he himself has killed children. He goes, I have to get into their minds. Yeah. And they go, dude, I gotta turn you. And he goes, do you? <laughs> I get into their minds. I know what they want to hear. Jennifer's family will never find out. I am one of them. <laughs> Jennifer's family. Don't tell Jennifer's family. Jenny gets very upset. Jenny, well, she's we, Jenny. Now. We just broke seven hundred followers on our YouTube channel. <laughs> <laughs> Worldwide predators. Boop a doop. <laughs> yeah, he is light on views for catching yeah, predators, dude, that's man. What I'm Jesus. We're worldwide. He also We've got only nine... been in Arizona, but we're worldwide. I like he's one third. In Thumbs down. <laughs> yeah, like, hey, play. Who's this guy? I want to know who his buddy is. It's like the uh, To Catch a Predator Big Time Tommy. That's Jocelyn. <laughs> I'm Jennifer. That's Jocelyn. <laughs> I'm more, I'm more, my character's more oral based, you know, if I want to suck off old men. He goes, Tommy does this thing when he fucking like, talks about eating ace or whatever. He goes, <laughs> he goes, yeah. he goes, I can't do the girl voice so much, but I can make good squish now with goes, my hand. <laughs> <laughs> Because I let him believe I'm a little overweight, but I'm real nasty. <laughs> I do more than Jennifer, though. No, she is prettier. You can tell by the voice, but I do more. Bring your friends. You know some other kid fuckers? I don't know. Bring them more. You know some other piece of shit child molesters? <laughs> Bring them. My mom and pa are gone. <laughs> My ma died in 67. Is <laughs> this <laughs> real shit? He goes, all right, well, my dad was real screwed up from V. <laughs> we were never close. It's probably why I end up in this latchkey situation I find myself. <laughs> Talking to older men for comfort. Lost my dad in a little skirmish over there in Syria. Yeah. Possible sexual predator. This is a, a group of people that are in the uh, that are in the uh, streets just exposing these guys. Uh, take a look at it. Now, if they get on their desk... Hey, this is a guy we just arrested for tampering with evidence, and there's a bunch of guys that are exposing sexual predators. This guy was trying to erase it. The state attorney's going to look at it, and those charges get amended while that predator's in jail. You know what I'm saying? I, mean, I would, I mean, I would hope. Oh, this is from my understanding. And this is what I'm. This is what I'm getting from from law enforcement. It's not. It's not the meetup that's going to get these. Are guys they talking arrested. through a League of Legends microphone? What's that? <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to storm the castle and get there. I got 13 magic points. Dude, these guys are so funny. Smoking in the camera. What's up, bro? <laughs> Dude, Yo. you know how I get down. I love, I love designer drugs and kitchen pedos. <laughs> he looks like he's got... He Nothing like, like bringing down a purple and a freshly steamed out purple button down, He bro. looks like he's got oxy eyes. I mean, yeah. He can barely open them. He's scratching himself. I caught this prick fuck when I was on my way to get chops made in my eyebrows. <laughs> you don't know. You don't know. These guys, are, these guys are talking about catching predators or systems in their car. <laughs> What are you pushing? Kenwood 220s? I have to show you guys this just because I came across it. So this girl apparently, Jenny's story, the truth about Shane Quayle, the older boy. Let's go, dude. I she goes, he's a fucking idiot who sleeps on my couch. <laughs> Shane is my boyfriend. He fucks mo anyone who doesn't believe, he fucks these guys. So apparently, I, I guess she gave him like $1,000 and got fucked over and did a hour-long video on it, but... 
the first comment is just so shade throwy at her. So when are you going to do a video on how you've burned your best friend Sarah King? How you oh, were engaging in sexting with her husband, sent a vagina picture of you in a tub. Yeah. <laughs> is that, oh, well, go, get it, Melissa Bender. What are all the comments? All of these has so few. Melissa views Bender, oh they, snap! They're <laughs> citing Spicy. actual friends. Yeah, that's how small the circle is. Can I be honest with you? Everybody listening right now, tell them what this clip is called. Christine. Jump in on this conversation, everyone <laughs> listening. <laughs> It's it called Jenny's Story, The Truth About Shane Coyle. It's got 13,472 views now. Let's I'm really do... jump in and find out what this bitch has done to her friends. I want to do a... pictures to your friend's boyfriend? <laughs> I want to do, a... do a parody video called Dan Soder, Dan's Story, The Truth About Shane Gillis. <laughs> the ultimate... He sent dick pictures yeah. to me, to I Trish, <gasps> to your mom. <gasps> Hit play. See, this lady, this lady's going to be great. She's fucking sour grapes, and it looks like she would take a good fucking tub pussy pig. <laughs> I bet her pussy's a mound. I bet she got a fat one. Like it's fat before the lips even. You know what I mean? A oh, yeah, yeah. beefy? A be- like you could really grab it like you're grabbing a fucking yeah. like a like a like an expensive burger from a weird uh bistro. I like a lady I like a lady that yeah. Like a Kaiser bun burger. You know what I mean? Where it's too much. They make the burger fit the bun, not the other way around. Oh, okay. Yeah, that exactly yeah. that one. That's the exact pussy I'm talking about. Oy. You can grab a sparse hair. Oh, uh, you know what just bummed me out? I realize that. That's what I see when I look down. That's what happens to me. I got a sparse bush and I can grab right above my fucking cock. I'll see you guys later. <laughs> she looks like she's always at a dog park. <laughs> I did some summer plays when I was younger. All right, plays. It's going to be great. I got pregnant when I was 13. I'm just going <laughs> to wait for a couple of minutes so that I can get... Um this People is one hour here. and five minutes long, by the way. <laughs> yeah, Modine yeah. talked about us less. Yeah. This live? Yeah. <laughs> so if you guys can see me, make sure that you can see me. This is hard for her. She goes, all right, we're syncing it up. Ready to go? You guys ready to get <laughs> energetically punched? It's going to be funny. It's 35 minutes of this. She goes, everyone's seeing? You guys got me. Are we live now? Now? Tom? Go now. Go, Who's Tom? How are we doing? Who's running the stream? Are we up? Okay. Are we? Go to the now? middle. Of the, go to minute 35. Yeah, right there. Talking to this? Drop it. Yes. I've been on the same medication since Did she I was age seven. fucking 10 years since the last picture? <laughs> the same medication. She goes, what a great line to jump into. She goes, I've been on the same medication since I was 17 years old. Yes. Did <laughs> she age 10 You're the girl from Texas? You're the girl from Texas? Well, here's what's going on. This is what he's doing. He's known to do this to people. This is what he does. Okay. Don't believe anything he says. You want proof? Bam. Here you go. What? What? You want to see a so-called contract? Look at my love line. Bam. <laughs> <laughs> Me and him are meant to be together. <laughs> she goes, put your hand up against me. Look at that. Sign of the Christ. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The Holy Christ. Trinity is real. <laughs> <laughs> Believe now or perish. She picks her shirt, picks her shirt up. There's a, there's a stab wound. <laughs> you will all burn on hell on earth and I will ascend. Goodbye. <laughs> Shane Coyle's a fag. <laughs> 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 Couldn't even get it up when he fucked me. Yeah. She goes, I'll tell you this. He has a thin, he has a thin dick. Yeah. No. I can, as you say, dyked out with Jennifer. <laughs> Sit on my feet and no love it. How the hell are you going to have a contract from a major film producer or show producer when your name is not even spelled correctly. By the way, he does look, I don't know what she's even talking about, but the guy, she's definitely talking about him, and yeah. that guy looks like a guy who would tell people <laughs> for sure that he's got a yeah. film. He goes, oh. yeah, they bought the story of my life already. He's Craig yeah, Glazer. 100%. He's guy. like Craig Glazer. He's yeah, like a young totally. Craig Glazer. Wait, go back to his video with him and the guy doing fucking system <laughs> talk. <laughs> this, this, is is two hours and, yeah. this is two hours and 54 minutes long. <laughs> <laughs> These guys do not skip. They are not cut down the webisodes, huh? Doing yeah. a whole Rogan. Go, just jump in. Yeah, they're doing this a YouTube. Rogan with a scientist. <laughs> this YouTube video is my Godfather epic. Yeah, yeah. The one, two, and three together. You know what? They Some of those people thought those Lord of Rings movies was too long. <laughs> <laughs> I said, I think I can do a driving video with but a fat Goomba from the Oscars. <laughs> he goes, I got a friend. I got a fat Paisan that I can call. would not it funny if they don't realize they're both doing the thing to each other? Yeah. They're, just, they're, just they're individually doing like solo things right now and waiting to call one another as 
a as a little so girl. Funny. We goes, like to keep it cinema verte. That's what I'm saying. We yeah. show everything. Yeah. I gotta take a call. Now nah, keep taping. <laughs> keep taping. The guy on the left is the Shane guy who acts like a little girl to catch predators, and that's the guy who acts as predators to catch little girls throwing pussy. He goes, he goes, <laughs> he goes they meet up. It's, it's the pina colada song of predators. He goes, oh my god, were you one in the same? <laughs> Shut up. We're both 35 year old adults. <laughs> Can you go to? Um, I got an hour and 45 minutes in the video. So that guy for sure has a drug problem, though, because his whole body changed shape. Oh, look, dude. Look at his face and arms. It's Hold different. on. I think it's him being Jennifer. You don't get a lot of sleep. Predators yeah. don't sleep. I don't sleep. <laughs> dude, I sleep here. I eat Adderall's for breakfast. I, I sleep here in the Nebuchadnezzar. <laughs> the Nebuchadnezzar. <laughs> well, you know what? That's we could talk brilliant. about that. I'll tell you what these guys are probably into. Beef. Yeah. Lots of beef. Young beef. <laughs> and you can get great beef from Butcher Box. And we're back, just like that. Oh, dude, please play the video. I think he's doing Jennifer. Oh. <laughs> he's so proud. We get this handled for you. <laughs> he's pissed at a certain what store. The Thanks for your payments. Your confirmation number is five. What the fuck hey, is he doing? I'm paying my bills. <laughs> it can't be all predatory. Dude, he's got Nerf in the background. He's got like Nerf guns. That's what I use. Yeah, dude, he's a bizarre motherfucker, this yeah, guy. Yeah, go forward because I don't watch him pay his fucking He's Verizon definitely on bill. party drugs, dude. <laughs> yeah. He's like, honey, do we pay Spectrum? <laughs> <laughs> like a oh, big old chump in that vape. <laughs> he smokes cigarettes and vapes. You guys want to listen to me listen to my new tape I just made? I just made a sick mix, bro. He goes, yo, bro, you think it's house, but then it turns into metal, and then it's rap? I'm the, Dude, bad, boy. Saw... I'm the bad boy Bill of child predator catches. He goes, they don't like my style. I'd fuck a child in front of this guy before I believe he can stop me from doing anything. <laughs> Dude, right, let me try one more, and then I want to say thank you one more time. Gosh, man, this guy with the golf club. Old ass 74 year old dude, man. What? Get yourself an inshore shake, sit down in a rocking chair, and read some old Mother Hubbard Aesop's fables to somebody, not a kid. Aesop? Perfect of yourself until you fall asleep, long asleep. What? 64 <laughs> years old. Oh, dude, he's, he is 100% Vicodin out right oh, now. Hold on, That's how I sound. No, no, you think, Josh. Think, Josh I got back pains. That's not related. Right <laughs> yes, I'm floating up here in those clouds, and I got to understand. Hold on a second. Hold on. Wait. Keep recording while I change my fentanyl patch. <laughs> yes, anyways. Oh, hey. there's the stuff. Hey, there it is. Oh, oh, yes. I'm ready to be Jennifer now. He goes, he goes, now I got a child like Wanda. Woo, time to go be Jennifer. Of a little bit. Whoa! <laughs> hey. that's, that's what boys kindergarten is hey. in. Oh my god! I can't believe it. Is the rim spinning? She goes, patch. Patch is better than your veins. Is if it? I had too much of drinkers, my pussy all wet. <laughs> I'm a Samus the filled sponge. He's a half hour into sucking a guy's dick before he realized he was supposed to just be decoy the whole time. <laughs> oh wait, wrong day. He goes, oh. <laughs> he goes, son of a bitch. I missed the Jets game. <laughs> he 100 percent hooked up with the girl that did the anti him video. Yeah. You know, that's that you can just tell that's oh, the kind yeah. of girl he's into. You know what I mean? No. Dude, hit yes. point. Just hit no point. way. Just hit point. Dude, he used, I'll, tell you, no, I'll tell you this guy is. This is a guy, you look at he she's a, a a fucking whatever broad and he he probably like he I mean, he Took may have money fu- from her. He may have fucked her but he definitely like used her for yeah, shit. Yeah, that's what I'm like saying. That. He yeah. probably gave her some dick and in, in, in exchange I thought probably, you were saying that's she, like like he's into her. I'm like no no, no, no he's no, got no, he's no, got no. a, a he weird used, yeah, dude. young Dominican girl who uses him. <laughs> yes. Yeah. That's why the Nerf guns in the back for her kid. <laughs> Little Diego <laughs> likes it. I don't know if he has a predisposition as being an ethnic to like guns. I don't know. I but bad. I'll give him this. Oh, he's got two stripes in his eyebrows? This guy's the best. Hey, Conchita, I'm the only thing standing between these predators and your little boy over there getting at the old fucking wazoo. Hey. hey give me a kiss on the cheek. <laughs> kiss me right. Do the right thing. <laughs> Do the right thing. Give me a hickey so my friends think I'm a baby. <laughs> <laughs> Suck it up. <laughs> Suck it in there. I could take it. This guy's awesome. All right. Time to pay cable. <laughs> Spectrum, I'd like to make the minimum payment, please. $50. Are you offering any bundle deals with Cinemax HBO? <laughs> 
Ah, uh, scandula gulgeets, my mother's Sunday gravy. I can't even. Yes, I, I thank God I got this new grapefruit vape. <laughs> oh, man. Predators sleeping in today, I guess, eh? <laughs> 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 uh, boom, bang, boom, huh? I guess there's, none, I guess there's no predators down <laughs> yeah. in the water. I guess, uh, I guess my day's over. Time yeah. to go to Rite Aid and pick hey, up my prescription. Hey. Right. I guess these weren't the uh, Glen Gary leads, eh? You know what I mean? <laughs> All right, Dash Cam, I got to be honest with you. The fishy's on biting. <laughs> Maybe next time I'll do a little prep work before I engage you for the better part of three hours. He goes, you know what, though? I'm pretty sure this store owner is pretty pissed I've been in the parking lot this whole time. <laughs> I've been in the parking lot at his uh, children's warehouse. It's yeah, not going good. His nail salon. Pretty mad I'm parked right out front. <laughs> you know, I'm trying this new vape juice called Talk 56. <laughs> it's pretty good. <laughs> Guys, my friend, anyway, my friend sells it. You, in the link below, you can see his website. Swipe up for he details. He sells uh, THC stuff, CBD. <laughs> Look at this guy. He wants to talk. Hey. I'm talking to you. <laughs> this guy's so great. How long am I on balls for? I'm going to be wrong out there today. Oh, here we go. This is 40 more minutes of... <laughs> Left in this. All right, here it is. Let's see. Is that the name of the decoy? Oh, is. Looks like he's filling up vape juice. <laughs> Gotta get such a handy. It looks like he's trying to. <laughs> like, it looks like he's trying to pull heroin out of a needle. Yeah, he's he's a hundred percent on us. Like, you gotta get the, you gotta get the water mixed in with the thing, and then the, go for a little like cotton these, ball, and then oh, there's the there's one intervention. There's the part I love watching it get sucked up. Oh yeah, it's going right <laughs> in my veins. Yeah, there he is. All right, let's see what he's talking about. Just a random, some random time. Go for it and just yeah, drop it. You violated, okay, guys. Those of you that stand with me, I thank you so much. These scummy troll haters, I hate using that word even. They got my page. They got my page deleted by mass reporting. It's okay. The ultimate decoy, it's not a page. I'm not a page. What? <laughs> I'm by form. I'm a poison. Not life. <laughs> like, listen, I suffer from TMJ. <laughs> Is a man just like you. A man that stands before you with every single emotion. What? Be it good or bad, anger, guilt, hate, love, All right, Tennessee sadness. Williams. I'm going to go about to go cop a few bundles from my man, Jose. <laughs> Just like yourself. I'm but a man like you. My pains that you've taken away, that you've gotten deleted by mass reporting, does not mean nothing other than, guess I got to go harder again for the third time. Does he believe he's, he's being stopped because people don't want him doing this kind of good in the world? Yeah, That's yeah, like it's yeah, so yeah, insane. Yeah. 100%. Yeah. 100%. Well, this isn't over. God. I'll tell you that. <laughs> this conversation's not <laughs> over, everyone. Uh, Josh Adam Myers, Mike Cannon, thank you so much for being here, oh, man. Thanks for having God, us. We just, you guys just opened up a Crypt Keeper thing. Of, I mean, we're gonna be we're just gonna be a down. This guy spiral. Shane Shane Coyle will be a part of this show for some time. Oh, maybe take a, maybe take a couple hours with Jennifer. She'll lose some stuff. She'll get your, she'll get your head straight. You want you want to meet my friend Jennifer? Mike, Mike can't. I I've done this for a lot of celebrities getting ready to do yeah. big taping. I, I go don't I go don't use uh, him. You I go, seem on the rage, man. I guess I can meet you somewhere. Jay, I go don't don't got don't, him. I go Jay, don't use it. It's actually this guy Shane, and you're gonna go to the Vic Lombardi rest stop, and it's gonna be him. You're gonna have like a gassed fight in the grass. <laughs> That's hilarious. Yeah. They ask you to meet him at truck stops. Yeah. <laughs> What's uh, the? He goes. So meet me over at the Flying J right off the 81 interchange. <laughs> I'll be in flannel and those big suspenders you see Home Depot employees wearing. Yeah. <laughs> Big J. Robeson, the Bonfire, Comedy Central, XM Satellite. But so uh, this this guy that we're that we are going to get into today, I would say easily is up there with Craig Glazer as far as bonfire lore will be. Because this guy, yeah. Jay called me on Thursday. You guys were watching the video. We will Jeremiah. have him on the show. He will call in the show. I was at home. So, anyways, we watched this. We watched the story on Wednesday. Mm-hmm. Guy does the voices. Uh, Black Lou was like, "Oh, he's from G's the Gents." Who knew he was from G's the Gents? I think. I think Black, Black Lou, Lou was yeah. like, you looked him up, and you found him, and you're like, oh, he's on G's to Gents, which I would like to watch before we watch. Uh, yeah, there was only one clip I saw. It was pretty great. Okay. So we, uh, I get a call on Thursday from Jay, and he's like, you have to watch this guy's YouTube channel. And I'm with Becky Owen, and we're just like, yeah, there. I want to take you a little even earlier than that was me and Josh just around, and I told Josh about this. 
uh, guy, and we started watching the things, right? We watched probably yeah. three hours worth I mean, of it. I mean, it just kept going and going. Well, I found an episode you guys didn't find, so it was great when we sunk <laughs> up, because it was, I was like... Oh, I remember that. <laughs> you could just go... <laughs> and I was going to take notes on these, but I'm telling you... Grab one and throw a dart in the middle of the fucking video, dude, and it'll you now, will be Jer- able to roll. Jeremiah's uh, podcast, Jeremiah Wonders, is one of my favorite because you get to do that with the voice modulation mic and change up stuff and do different voices. And it's so much fucking fun to do. This guy does a very impressive job of doing several voices at once, but it's so psycho watching him do this. You're seeing like the yeah. crazy man behind the curtain. Dude, basically. Yeah, he sets up his own pedophile things, yeah. and he plays several characters in the process. And he calls. It's going to be harder to explain. Let's just give you his background. Let's show the clip from G's to Gents. Uh, and his name is what was it? his name? Shane. Sean C- Shane C on G's to Gents. C E E. We'll tweet this out at the Bonfire SXM. Not only is that disrespectful. But that's defacing my face. Yeah. Defacing my like face. Knocking somebody, bro. Before the chapter meeting. That's so funny. It's just disgusting. It's fucking disgusting. You know who did it. No, 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 I'm telling you. He's not did it. Right? It's not the first, you know, slimy thing. You pack of new ports in the ham. I'm gonna know your mother, dog. Right now, with my eyes are pointed at you, Keyson. Yeah, I'm gonna knock him out, bro. No, man, let's go. No, I'm gonna find out who did it, bro. No, 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 Things are getting tense. Things are getting real. It's such a. It's a prop. It's a prop picture. On a reality show, and it's just great that that's how he's just like, no, Steve. Fuck Yo, do this. not deface. Yo, <laughs> two my things, dude. Picture. Two things. Don't deface his face. Yeah, ever. And do not try to fuck him pretending to be a 15 year old. <laughs> no, or Those if are you're the only two things. If you're an old man, if you're an old man for prepubescence with a boner for prepubescence, this guy's gonna fucking track you down. I'll tell you what. If you're an old truck driver who's not sure if you have a Let, predisposition let's, for 15 year old girls. This guy might find you anyway, and, and sort of make you want to do that. Yeah, I, I've heard I've heard rumors that he's the one that broke the Epstein case. <laughs> Let's finish. It's this out season. there in the world it's circulating. A, I, listen, I got a guy at Newsweek. He gives me some bits and stuff. I don't know what I can use. It's stirring around. <laughs> the Epstein thing was blown open by him. Uh, let's finish this clip from G's to Jets. Sure. That spit in my face right there. You know that. You know what I want to do to this guy? I want to. I want to. I want to have him wrapped up in a trunk on his way to South Philly. Is he from South Philly? Is he from South Philly? Oh, you can only hope so, dude. <laughs> dude, is he from Philadelphia? I didn't even try know to look, but I hope so, so much. <laughs> I'll take full responsibility for this guy. This guy was built for the bonfire. Go he birds. Was- he was built. He was built to smoke vapes. That's what yeah. it looks like. He's one hundred percent sold fake ecstasy before. <laughs> like he has oh. that look. Yeah, dude. He looks like he produces POV porn. <laughs> Although I will yeah. say, in G's the gents, he has a current Josh Edemeyer's haircut for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> he, goes, he goes. What if in the video? Yo, I'm rocking like, my jam haircut. So I got this idea for musicians to do comedy. It's a <laughs> the goddamn comedy jam. Oh my god, he's Bizarro Josh Edemeyer. <laughs> How about if the guitar I play from Def Leppard did a tie seven. Oh, I mean crazy, bro. <laughs> what if we took the band Cinderella and had him do improv? <laughs> Think about it, bro. Be fucking wild. <laughs> Give the basis for White Lie in a city name. Let's yeah. get started. Well, let's go, bro. Uh, let me take a suggestion from the audience. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yes, and. Yeah. Yes, and. Zip, zap, zap. Are you looking up if he's from Philly? Christine, no. are you on it? Yeah. Well, let's get back to G's the Gents, because I want to see what happens when you deface his face. Did it, and it's real. Hey, hey, whoever wants to be a man and step up, That's you put an X on my face, step up. Because I will go home by the Don't be a punk. That, hey, that shit, that shit, that shit yeah. making me high. Like, who the fuck did that to my man's picture? <laughs> oh. Who did that shit, son? Who would do that? <laughs> Hey, guys, Dan, I'm the bad boy from Denver. You guys are all idiots. <laughs> yeah. I just want to let you guys all know you're a bunch of douchebags. I want you just be like, who did it? He goes, hey, man, who gives a shit? Let it go, bro. Yeah, yeah. let it go. <laughs> I got like, some chicks coming over from Bad Girls Club. <laughs> yeah. How long are we going to be here for anyway, man? Just wear your stupid fucking blazer and just shut up. There. I heard they give you a gift bag when you're done. I'm having a hard time being a gent right now. <laughs> you're bringing the G out of me. He goes, oh, yo, I got tea coming up. <laughs> High noon tea. 
I swear to God. Let me pull on out. my Mars tricolored cookies. I <laughs> on my Mars. Yo, my man. Yo, my man. You act up. You can't get figure sandwiches. You gotta chill. Yo, hold my crumpet. He goes, yo, what? He goes, what if this is where we see this is like Batman Begins, and at the end of this clip, he's like, hello, it's me. I <laughs> <laughs> swear he found his flow. That's his origin that's story. His, that's yeah. his Ra's Al Ghul moment. Yeah. He's, like, he's like, yo, I'm gonna take him down, pretending I'm a little girl, and these guys are like, you wanna fuck me? You're a bad boy. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Oh, where is it? I know you were going right for it. I thought you were going for the Christine drop. I don't know. Yeah. Damn it. Damn it. Looks like somebody can beat the Witsk. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like the Witsk just got beat. <laughs> There's our second shirt. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I beat oh, the Witsk. Fuck me? The oh, now you want to fuck me? It's out of context. <laughs> now you're just being mean to Christine. You want to have a context? For you, John, you can <sighs> oh, thank I God. Yeah, Good that, save, that's Lou. It, dude. <laughs> Good fucking save. You want me to sing? Sing. For his grandpa? Give it to me one more time. For your jaw, you can fall. For your jaw, you can fall. Sing. For your jaw, you can Let's watch the end of this clip. Got this big marker. Automatically, I thought it was Kisan who did it. No, you feel who it is? Go with your no, cut. C runs upstairs frantic. Immediately, I'm like, oh. They're gonna think I did that. I didn't do it. You already know what it is. Keyson did it. But he don't understand this is chess, not checkers. You feel me? Because you're doing it for the camera. <laughs> oh, shit, dude. That's such a good D line. That's such a good line. Shit, D boy. <laughs> D boy came with the best line of the day. Yeah. D it's all about that long game. It's not about that short game, play. <laughs> you know how many times that was said in that house? A lot. A lot. Yeah, you got to see your goals and picture them shits. You know what I'm saying? But it's all good. Fake wisdom. Hey, the it's fake about the marathon, wisdom. not the foot race, play. All that, all that fake wisdom that was kicked around by those nincompoops. <laughs> you got like, to flow like water, son. Yeah. You it's, like you chicken, it's like chicken 48. Thing. You know what I mean? You gotta be Delta Force. No, what? Yeah, what are you, you fucking say? jiving for? You turkey? <laughs> Dude, if you think about it, the beach is like the Earth sandbox, bro. Yeah. Ain't no bigger shark than a whale. Uh oh. It's about to pop off. Ha <laughs> ha. I'm trying to ignore you. I'm trying to ignore you right now. What? May I please walk away from you? No. That's what I'm here no. for. You feel you me? Can't walk away. Pussy. You can't walk away. Pussy. You can't walk away from me. Are you guys want a kiss? Yeah. May I please walk away, <laughs> sir? Uh, yeah. Excuse me, sir. I hate mm. this. He goes, good job. You're a gentleman. <laughs> You've done You've it. You've walked away. Ring the bell. I killed the man that was the G. You have passed the final test. <laughs> Please go grab me a new picture of Shane. Uh, he now. has officially become a gentleman. Shane, you are cast out. <laughs> it was all because of this present. terrible, awful Negro. <laughs> I'm in his face, I'm like, dude, I wish you would. You're good, you're what? good, you're good. What? Pussy! You're little. Pussy! You're little. Pussy! I want you to get mad. Pussy! Ooh, you're nice. What? I am a con artist. I am the best con artist probably that you've ever met. Wow, I mean, what a great... There you go, Lou. Oh, my God! He, he did that to himself? He was Kaiser Soze, the G... Wow. The Holy house? shit, dude. I've been the pedophile the whole time. <laughs> oh, what if I told you? I do the voices. <laughs> I do everything. I, I, I do the pedophiling. I give these guys the world. <laughs> I give them romance, sex, everything they want. And then I take it away. I'm Thanos. <laughs> just like that. Just like that. The greatest trick the devil away. ever pulled was telling everybody he's not existing. Dude, how great of every just time? Like that. Just what like that. Iron Man, Kassan, Groot, <laughs> D-Ball, gone. Snizzy. What if, <laughs> <laughs> what if every <laughs> the Jets? What if every Black, Pan Black Panther? Sunil, Gamora, Kassan, Sunil, Tishon, Kishon, Kassan, Shlamika, Little Man Man. Dude, that would uh, that would be so great if every pedophile he caught, he gave the Al Pacino speech from The Devil's Advocate. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the devil. <laughs> Touch, but don't taste. Yeah, 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 yeah. The guy's like, oh. Touch, but don't feel. Hey, man, I was just here to fuck a kid. <laughs> He goes, are you, you're, you're not the kid. Are you the kid? Man, I'm horny as fuck. I can't Just, wait for his reveal. Oh, Yo, this face, the face, that face. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, tweet this out at the Bonfire SXM, but let's watch the end of it, because this is incredible. I didn't and think it was going to go this great. The face, my own face. I want you to take his face. The face. I <laughs> put it on my face. And then the face. I faced off myself. That's why you can't tell. <laughs> I'm the Castor Troy. The face off. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> to see you did 
I chose to X my own picture out because there's no way in hell anybody's going to think that I did it to myself. Everybody, of course, is already going against Keyson. The negative vibe is leaning towards him. These guys are all definitely going to drop a ball on him. What? You're not pussy. You ain't going to do nothing, though. Now all I got to do is just sit back and watch Keyson sealing the deal. I got you in my pocket. And you in my pocket. I got you in my pocket now. You feel me? It's crying. Uh, I don't understand. You're in my pocket. <laughs> How many times do you think somebody said, you feel me on that show? Yeah. <laughs> what were the rules of... Whoa. This is from, this is from TMZ <laughs> 2008, uh, where what? they got arrested, both Whoa. of them. From James to Jens to jail. Those two what's guys. Your, what's the guy's name? Harvey? Who does the TMZ thing? Oh, yeah, Harvey's <laughs> the main guy. Yeah, he's like, these guys look like they went from Jesus to something else. He was friends with Kisan the whole time? God damn it. Shane Coyle was arrested yesterday, but was he? <laughs> in Lee County, Florida, for violating the terms of a probation issued in 2007. Blah. The year he was busted for drugs and a robbery. We got a funny one. Um, The guy from Jesus and Jens got arrested. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure he has a child out of wedlock. Oh! oh! Damn, we could do a TMZ, dude. Oh, easy. easily. We easily. just did it. We just TMZ'd. <laughs> Everyone listening? You just got TMZ'd. Black Lou, we have to get you some crazy dreadlocks. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, dude. Oh, I can't wait to get a... Let's get them twists out. <laughs> can't wait TMZ to get a... in here? I can't we wait need for need a some dreadlocks. thick coffee cup. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's going to have your fucking name on it. I'm going to get you like a, like a chalice. <laughs> i got to work on my triceps, though, if I'm going to have a t-shirt and just pop these arms up and go, Jacob, what's <laughs> yeah, going on over... Uh... Just over the cubicle? <laughs> I heard Liquid oh, yeah. Todd has been conf uh, confronting... <laughs> <laughs> You have to have a fantastic elderly body. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Jacob, you could be our uh, Harvey, Harvey, dude. Harvey, yeah. He's about the same Hell size. Yeah, dude. Oh, perfect. You could be in the booth over there just leaning over with a cup of coffee all the time. That'd be fantastic. Oh, just coming, throwing dick vibes at Christine, and it's like, I, I, yeah. I don't get it with the whole Kardashian thing. I just don't get it. I don't get it. Uh, oh, the hyenas Joe are back. Joe is on board. The hyenas are back. Dude, is Shane Quayle from Philly? Everything's coming up I, Florida on him. Yeah, I'm not finding. Like, he doesn't have a Wikipedia page. Do you think it was just. You know what? We, are, we, were, watching G, we were watching G to Gents, and that could just be a throwaway thing where you say a dangerous city like you have affiliation there. Yeah. Yo, man, we come back to Detroit. <laughs> things going to be different. <laughs> South Philly's a weird one to say, though. And then also, I, I'm not sure if we went over this already, but there's this other page where it's Prank Call Mafia Shane. What does that mean? He has a whole other YouTube channel where he does prank calls, apparently. Oh, is this why he says... So we looked up earlier on his Instagram, and uh, Black Lou found out that he lists himself as comedian. Comedian, so foremost. I was looking for... because this The is, ultimate decoy prank in well, between look, bringing down scumbags. <laughs> I, like to, I like to call restaurants and make fake reservations. <laughs> yeah, that's so great. <laughs> he's doing hey, we got a party at 16 coming in, 9 p.m. He's doing everything you can do with voices <laughs> except be uh, entertaining. <laughs> <laughs> yes. oh, so, well, my best work is, uh, you know, getting pedophiles to meet up with me and also, you know, getting women that work at the grocery store on the overnight shift uh, give them a little hard time <laughs> <laughs> I give, I give, you know I make this shift I a give little, a little <laughs> bit of a hard time hey, I'm just giving you a hard time <laughs> yeah alright alright I'm just busting your chops I wonder if I'm just breaking your keones I wonder if he ever gets mixed up while he's doing the ultimate decoy and he suddenly goes like you know is your refrigerator running <laughs> yeah and he goes baby baby it's gonna be running all over you she's like I'm, I'm looking for I'm looking for IP freely <laughs> yeah he's like yeah I'm being freely right now <laughs> Oh, I can't wait to oh, be Oh, shit. <laughs> let's, do, let's just show the ultimate. Let's just show the... Some uh, prank calls? No, the ultimate decoy. Let's get to the prank calls. That's like the prologue or the epilogue. Okay. The first is you got to see the ultimate decoy well, because we, we found out about it. I was going to say let's go on a prank call because we should take our first break soon. And then come, I'm telling you, this is going to be yeah. hard to walk away from, dude. Tud is something we can't just pass on. Oh, my God. I almost <laughs> forgot about Tud. Oh, Tud. my God. Is that a long one or a 15-minute one? They're uh, all like 45 minutes. No, like no, these, no, none of these are short. There's 14, 20. You can should, figure it all out with we three clicks. The, we should watch the one. Let's take a break. We'll find which video to watch. We'll mm -hmm. come back. We'll watch the ultimate decoy and do a real in-depth look. I'm Deep telling dive, you, dude. it's going to be a good laugh. This guy is very... I, I take it back. He's extraordinarily entertaining for all the wrong reasons. Why I say he's built for the bonfire is because we excel at watching people that have small amount of self-awareness, large egos, and are doing things without any context. 
And Jeremiah, you came in on a nice day. I'm so excited. I, yeah. the, what makes me the most excited about this is none of these have more than like 7,000 views. Oh, so we're going to get those views. Oh, we're about up. to ramp that up big time, buddy. I think so I'm I, like, I know that these are diamonds in the rough that you guys have yes. found somehow yeah. because whenever you get into this section of YouTube, there's gems. When Whoa. Let me explain Jay's ear. It's like Jay. It's like Jay is like a music producer, and he like went into a club to have a drink, <laughs> well, and then Cal he just Bell, heard. Dude. But instead of music, <laughs> it's is, assholes. He, he it's just, just is, aggressive assholes. This is like his Arctic monkeys. <laughs> yeah, but I'm saying like, but Jay, Jay can be having a drink, and he's like, "Who's this shithead talking right now?" And he goes, "I'm gonna make him a star." <laughs> you know what's funny? When we watched these a couple days ago, like they were below two, so there's already been movement through you guys. We haven't even talked about it. Yeah, yet, we though. did. We did on we did on Wednesday. Yeah. Yeah. We did on Wednesday, and these were like at a thousand. Yeah, and dude. Six thousand. Let's get into it. Fucking campers are out Buddy, there. We are going to ramp it. I'm telling you, this take some time with this. Happened. Listening at home, take some time with this. Put it on in the background while you're doing, and just watch this moron work. Well, let's let's find a couple key episodes to guide them first. But we're gonna take a break. Uh, we're hanging out with Josh Adam Myers and Jeremiah Watkins. It's the bonfire. <laughs> let's, let's get to Shane, let's get to Shane Coyle because Shane Coyle now is spilling over into other things in our lives, and I didn't know this was well, a thing. Uh, before we get into Shane Coyle with this thing, we found is this oh is this what it is? Black Lou, this is the thing that you were like the crossover. No, he put on one of his pages that he was on Dr. Phil, but I think he's what? bullshitting. Uh, so I, I was looking. That. You saw that too, right? Is this guy best friends with Corey Feldman? Dr. Phil, and then I right. find he, it. He called, yeah. he called Dr. Phil's a pedophile. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, oh, hey, man. Hey, <laughs> He goes, yeah, Jennifer, I'm down to meet you in the Staples parking lot. Oh, okay, that's good. Can you get me lambskin condoms? <laughs> he goes, I would love to when he's filming them. I'm doing this for your safety. He goes, all right, well, I'll warn you right now. I'll open that car door, and Maggie's going to come out here and take a chunk of you. I don't want to give away his, his key phrases because you're going to hear him a lot. We're going to show the interaction. Let's go to the one that you and I both watched, which is um, 38. Uh, it's the old guy that's smoking the cigarette. Okay. The trigger. <laughs> sure. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I understand. Shane Coyle is a deeply troubled man. Not this man. guy. Okay. Let's do this one. The one that. Um, it's a 15 minute one. Yeah, if you go to the uh, if you go to the end, you can always see the guy. That's what's easy about these. And really, the killer is just go to the middle when he's talking to any of them, and then go to the confrontation because can you go to his channel boy. so I can tell you which one to go to? Yeah, sorry, I was trying to get our kids. Because like, if you go, if you start when he's like really trying to lure them in, I mean, he he adds like an extra like twenty five thirty minutes of like backstory so, yeah. that's completely unnecessary. Yeah, while we're looking this up, we'll explain uh, that. episode we'll, three. We'll explain that for sure. Episode three is the one that we should watch. He. Uh, exactly. It's so much entrapment involved in these. <laughs> <laughs> well, so what he does is he calls these guys on face on uh, on the phone and has conversations with them where he pretends to be a teenage girl. But what's funny is he starts giving up information because he just assumes from the jump that you're on board. You're like, fuck yes, you're hunting pedophiles. I like you. You're a good man. But what he doesn't realize is he comes off like an egregious asshole. Yeah. The entire just play a little bit. Just bring it like what, two minutes in. What is, wait, wait, wait. Because I just don't want to give too much. I want to tell what, what we're looking for here when we're going to be tweeting these out. Obviously, the ones we, uh, the ones we watch, and, and you can just find his page and, and tear. I mean, just sit back and tear through it. But I will say, uh, he he gets these guys lured in, and the camera of these videos the whole time until he confronts them. Is a dashboard camera that he has, yeah. like his iPhone or whatever. And while he's making these phone calls, you're staring at him and hearing the other person on the phone. And he, the whole time, is what you will not see if you're listening. That's why I encourage you to go watch these also. He's got like Muppet eyebrows that he just never stops making like weird, like mugging faces at the camera. It's he mugs a lot of the camera. Almost, he's doing like Manson faces. <laughs> like, he, yes. and Manson have the same thing. And when he does his voice, he'll like do the voice and be like, I mean, be right there, baby. You piece of shit. Yeah, yeah you fucking, fucking piece of yeah. shit. He does, like the, he does like the I'll slash your throat thing. Dude, it's crazy. God, you get so, so make sure you definitely watch it. But listening, you will get. Oh, enjoy. Oh, yes. Yeah. It's wonderful audio. Also, when you watch these videos, everybody, because the second I saw this guy, I was like, oh, he is 100% on oxys. Like, if you look at his <laughs> eyeballs, his eyeballs are Well, he's been holes. arrested for drugs. He's been arrested for he, drugs. Uh, yeah. He's ripping, he's ripping uh, vapes <laughs> and, and <smoking>. cigarettes. <laughs> That's how you know this guy's yeah, stressed Yeah, he out. also cracks vapes, like, in the middle of, like, he's like, yeah, baby, I really love that. <laughs> <laughs> it just covers the whole car. Oh, for a is second. that where they go to dinner in the real big restaurant? 
kiss me in the place I make pee from? <laughs> Oh, oh, he's, oh, and then over, he's and doing then, the things. He's pushing them. He's, he's pushing the rings. <laughs> and he goes like this. He goes, he's, he's driving. And he goes, he's doing the voice. He goes, yeah, baby, that one was sick. Yeah. <laughs> he, goes, he, just, he goes, baby, I love you so much. <laughs> oh, <that's hard. laughs> baby, I love you. He shoots, <laughs> shoots the arrow. Oh, no, I'm going to be right there. He shoots the nostril, the nostril like smoke a, arrow. Perfect like, music, Lou. He does like the rapid circles where he's like... Yeah. <laughs> just play, just play a little bit. Just play a little bit. Give it a taste. Bust open the bag. Right, this one's the one. 12 minutes, 13 minutes away. 13 minutes away. He's, this is him calling the pervert. Late night pervert. Early morning. Late night pervert. Pause it again. I'm sorry. I just want to always remember the things I want people to pay attention to in this thing always. Is, uh, is him making the call. He's furious always in between making the calls but he cannot wait to get them on the hook and i said and and, and over stress as dan and, and josh have boasted already he gives so much unnecessary information that he will be required to remember only yeah. <laughs> that matters like, nothing at all dude, it's like a, there's some, there's more storyline than the wire he like, really is he goes he goes, <laughs> remember, he goes four, four four hours ago you said that you grew up in muskogee he's like no <laughs> you guys like what's your favorite color he's like um i know that i know he's like my favorite color is burnt umber yeah he's like, well, you better write that down mother <laughs> remember that. and you'll see jeremiah watch him warm up for the voices this is my favorite this right here <laughs> my great aunt just got terracotta tiles no he goes <laughs> watch spanish him. style but this is him yeah, yeah like, why what <laughs> i grew up in a ranch style house and then moved to a two floor three bedroom two and a half bath and he goes i remember being in the basement when I was a kid, he goes, I thought you said you grew up in a ranch here. Shit, shit, shit. Uh, um, dude. <laughs> Fuck, dude. You got me, bro. Hey. You've been joking off to a die. Uh, How about that? Uh, huh? uh, this is the one. This is what we said. This hit point. Hello. Hello. That's in one Jeremiah's part. face is great. I'm so frightened right now. We're, oh, oh, back up, Christine. He's right. Get him working his pipes. That wasn't on the phone. Hello. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm yellow leather. <laughs> <laughs> Unique, unique, unique New York, unique New York. <laughs> men sell each other cheese sells by the seashore. A E I O U, and sometimes why? I fired up <laughs> on one dark morning and one bright night. Two dead boys got up to fight. Yeah, he goes, oh, I'm, ready. Oh, I'm ready to Get fucking this. bust this ass. Get this fuck stick on the phone. Hey, uh -oh. hey, I'm hold on, pervert. Hey, time out. Let me get it out of the baddest box real quick. Hello. Hello? The swing's there. The swing is there. Let's fuck it. Trying to drop the weights, kick the shoes. <laughs> I got I pissed on my hands in the shower. I got a grip on this fucking thing. <laughs> It's fucking. Oh, oh. The throat feels good. Throwing the spitball tonight. He goes. Oh, I'm gonna sing him a song. Oh, I'm gonna oh, sing yeah. him a song as a girl. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell. <laughs> I'm gonna I tell love you so much. This goes, is for uh -oh, you. Oh, someone's gonna get his uh, fucking recital. <laughs> I don't know much, but I know I love, love you. you. <laughs> and I don't know much. <laughs> Can we? Uh, I want to listen to the Neville Brothers now. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't know much. I don't know much. Yeah, oh, yeah. I'm pregnant. I forgot you can look sing. At, oh, look yeah. at this face. <laughs> look at me. No, no. He goes. He's busting a Neville brother. How come? What's his face was able to get rid of his fucking gross face shit? Uh, by Lamos, but fucking Aaron Neville just kept that goddamn. Oh yeah, the mole, that crazy eyebrow mole. Have you seen Aaron? Yeah. Have you seen the arms on fucking Aaron Neville? You go tell him to take his yoked, mole off, dude. He's Does built... my mole look weird? <laughs> no, nah, man, it looks great. You would yeah. tell me if it wasn't right. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you're not just saying that because I'm 65 and still wear sleeveless dungaree jackets. Mm. Are you? Is it? You know what's funny? I put a I put a denim vest on in 1994 and can't take it off since. <laughs> it won't get back over my papa. And I'm, he goes, I don't know much, but I know denim sticks to you. <laughs> I don't know much, but I know that denim's not very breathable. He goes, it's stuck to me like a skin graft. <laughs> I mean, exercise, weddings, everything, this thing's been with me. I, I wear it underneath everything like Jordan's North Carolina shorts. I wore it, I wore it to my, my grandma's funeral. <laughs> it, it is very strange that I'm dressed like a soft Luke Cage. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> 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 
<laughs> he had a little puffy afro and a sleeveless jean vest. <laughs> That's it. This was his look. What he about, put that shit on in 1987 and never look back. He goes, I can't get out. I don't know much, but I know that I'm locked in this thing. <laughs> Dude, I, all right, let's get to him warming up. <laughs> Is that a morning? What, what, yeah. what good waiting music? Sing for each other. The shadows waiting the bastard pervert. That's oh, is it. Time says twelve minutes, thirteen minutes away. Uh, let me call. Let me call. Late night pervert, early morning pervert. Let me call. Still got it. <laughs> Dude, it's so great. Still got the stuff. Oh, look, he gives a little oh, kiss face. Outing. Yeah. He's crazy. Hello. Hey, Daddy. What are you doing? I'm almost there. Hey, baby. It says, Mike. Let's... Hey, baby. Hi. Oh, my God. It's so early, and I'm still wide awake. Jacob's face. Jacob's face. Jacob's face. Jacob's face is yo, pure. Uh, yo, dude. motherfucker. Dude, this, it's so <laughs> funny because you, you, you piece of shit. Jay said this on the phone with me on Thursday, and I kind of believe it. I think there's a part of him that he likes being these young he girls. Yeah, it's, he definitely does. Hundred percent. You can tell he was pouting his lips in a way that is he's enjoying personifying this yeah. little girl. I mean. There, I mean, it's so early because I'm so young and our time construct is so different. <laughs> <laughs> is this the one that says that the... This is the best one. Where something happened with the guy. Yes. And then... That's why I picked this away. one. Yeah. Okay, this is like the one. This is the one where you... And this is the one. This has got all the hits. It's and it's it's. Uh, we're going to tweet it out to Bonfire SXN, but... It's, <laughs> this is his appetite for destruction. <laughs> it is. Do wait, wait, four, bring bro. that up. Bring that up right now. Do not hide that. <laughs> Show me what you have. I'll show you guys that you can, in fact, <laughs> get a Dun -dun. sign. Signed by Aaron Neville. Neville. Oh. We've got to get that. Oh, How much are they charging for that? How much is it? And I don't know much. Campus Unite. It doesn't say. I got to I got to start an account on this site. <laughs> start an account. Yeah, you have I'll to. If we had our own studio, that Look. would be on a wall of it. 100%. An Aaron Neville vest. Peace from Aaron Neville. Oh, I want to say I don't know what I don't know much, but thank you for your fanship. That's good. <laughs> what? No, he signed it big, dude. Look at that. He signed it big on the back. Right across the back. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know much, but you're going to have to pay for shipping and handling. <laughs> hey, thank you, Con Stranger, for removing this from me. Yes, it's, like, <laughs> it's just it's covered like in the armpits. He yeah. took it off, and he finally gets to die. Goes, like, I, I can finally be with my family. <laughs> he he inside skin and blood. <laughs> yeah. He's like, yeah. <laughs> it off. It's just like, yeah. just like the thorn from the lion's yeah. paw. Like his arms come off with it. It's like, it's like the witch from Game of Thrones. He takes, she takes off the crown, and then she walks out into the snow and just yeah. suddenly evaporates. But Aaron Neville's actually a, uh, a mild mannered uh, white dude from Iowa. But because of his heartbreak, he puts on that denim, and he's like, I don't know. Much. Aaron, the last thing for you to ascend is to just take that vest off. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> dude, I love it. Let's get a signed letter. I want it. Dude, we got to do best. it. All right, let's get back to the fucking ultimate. Let's make it part of all the things we have to bring into the studio every day. <laughs> <laughs> Just on a hanger. We've got to build our pylons. we got to change all the fucking wirings every day. Jacob's got to fucking de-louse the entire place. <laughs> you at? Um, it's, I'm passing exit 29, I guess, on 94. I have to get off an exit 31. Pause it. it. Yeah, here comes some multiple characters. But also, just no reason for just. I'm 12 minutes away. Oh, What's this guy going to do? Yeah, yeah everything. This guy's overselling There's it. a tree. I'm seeing a farmhouse. <laughs> Baby, what happens when your vagina gets slippery? Does that mean I'm happy to see you? He goes, I, I think you would know that at 16 years old. Are you <laughs> he goes, Baby, <laughs> are you mentally retarded? <laughs> It's more like it's more like you're not going to be grossed out right now. I have like an ingrown hair down my main, by my labia minoris. Which is, you know, I, Why are you using clinical terms? <laughs> you know, so, you know, so I watched that South Park. Uh, the are other you going to knock around my ovaries? Okay, <coughs> seriously, uh, did you just learn this in health class? I watched, what's going my on? My vulva 
is thick. Yeah, but I watched the margarine <laughs> episode of, of uh, South Park where Butters fakes like he's margarine yeah. and Mrs. Garrison, and he's like, so what do you like to do, margarine? He's like, I like to hang out with my friends, you know, get my snooze pounded. <laughs> and then Mrs. Garrison goes, well, what girl doesn't like having her nice poon pounded? <laughs> but it's like he does that with his voice where he's like, oh, baby, I'm so excited to ride your reverse cowgirl and maybe smoke a GPC and get some <laughs> keno numbers. I mean, I'll it. take a Winston if you've got it. Baby, do you have any Schlitz? I could really blow up some steam. We have to get through this because Dude, what this, this, what this evolves into us laughing about uh, is, is so funny. Yeah. Hit play. Hold on, let me ask the Uber driver. Multiple characters. Ma'am, can you tell me how long until you drop me off? Hold on, dear. I believe it's about... <laughs> It says 13 minutes, honey. Just to let you know, we're 13 minutes away. <laughs> pause. You got to pause it. Because yeah. then, then he gets, he reiterates Go back a, little, a yeah. little bit early. It's just an unnecessary back and forth. He has a volley for no reason. Also, the volume of the Uber driver did not change like it was faint <laughs> at all. It's like the exact same volume. It's, okay, baby. No, 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 no. He, guy, does. he goes He goes fainter with it. Watch. <laughs> this guy gets away with a lot because... These, These guys, guys are so horny. So horny. <laughs> they're so, so horny they're that they're, they're just not. Well, they're horny they're now because they've been bullied by what they believe is a 15-year-old girl who's insatiably dying to fuck them. <laughs> yeah, I know. And he's just like, this guy's like, this guy's just at home in his fucking wood-paneled fucking basement room. And he's yeah. like, man, I got this hot piece of ass. <laughs> she is on my dick. He's, he's like, like uh, won't maybe, stop calling. maybe we can just like masturbate in front of each other. He goes, I want it in me so hard, so <laughs> deep, I want so it. much I can take it. I'm telling you. Please, I'm wrong. <laughs> just, I want I'm ready, Daddy. I'm ready, Daddy. And he goes, I mean, I don't know. I just got out of something, and this seems like it's a lot. Just getting bullied. It's not even illegal. (laughs) So total entrapment. It's legal here. Look, I checked. The the guy's even like, he's like, you know, I'm getting kind of uncomfortable. You're making this really (laughs) awkward. No, I'll show you my school ID. I promise. I'm going to come there and really open you to career day. I never had a pee-pee in my mouth. Do I chew it? I don't think you chew my pee-pee. You chew piss. (laughs) <laughs> no, here it is. The multiple characters is just... <laughs> All right, she said 13 minutes. How, how long? She said about 10 minutes. <laughs> well, 10 to 12 minutes. So, All right. So you're All gonna, right. you're going to walk over to the Circle K? Yes, I am. All right, do you want to walk back, or do you want me to, like, tell the Uber driver to stay there? And we, I mean, it's up to you. No, no. We, <laughs> it's we unnecessary walk. shit. Dude, and then he's just mean mugging, where he's like, How oh, much? this piece of shit. He asks, like, a very rational question. Do you have any question. cash on you for the cab? He's like, I have, like, $10. Just... He said 13 Let me see if I can haggle him down. <laughs> Is it cool if I only have $7? I get kick you off of my car right now. <laughs> I tell you, no Brooklyn. And he goes, okay, you have convinced me with your fantastic <laughs> personality. Wow, you're yes, pre- I will take the $7. Are your breasts real? <laughs> and you're only 16. Oh, oh, wow. If I was a grown man, I would also have sex with you. Oh, dude, look at his uh, face. I thought your Uber driver was a woman. <laughs> <laughs> what? What do you want? I think they're a couple. <laughs> oh, no, it's a, it's a van. <laughs> it's, it's, a Uber pool. Pool. Yeah, it's an Uber pool. Everyone oh, look, in I'm in here with Rodney Dangerfield. <laughs> <laughs> he just doing a brush with you. <laughs> just so <laughs> <a> shitty <laughs> stand-up comedy impression. <laughs> you know, I forgot to tell you, we were talking the other day about a dream the other night that Homer Simpson. <laughs> Sylvester Stallone. <laughs> We're all working at the same Burger King. I think it would go a little something like this. <laughs> Homer's on fries. No, <laughs> oh, no. <my laughs> yeah, dude, that's so goddamn funny. She goes, <laughs> I'm in an Uber pool with Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> Where are you going? Where are you going? <laughs> Christopher <laughs> Walken. <laughs> We've got to get there. <laughs> He's just doing all the hacky. Work. I yeah. think you should have sex with. With this girl? Oh, this girl is illegal but hot. And like, <laughs> All right, that's pretty cool. Tell him I love him. It's a movies. real conundrum. I did it. He's just in a band, dude. Uh, and Mr. T is here. <laughs> All right. But before I pity the fool that doesn't sleep with this teenager. I know. I hate to do it before we get to the juice of this. Dan, go make your pish. The time is flying. What? Oh, how know. is this possible? We're, not even... We're an hour into the show already. <laughs> we, we, listen, we watched Dude, when I tell you guys, this... I'm telling you, if we get through this, it's plenty. <laughs> and then I'm telling you, 
His numbers are about to skyrocket. <laughs> there's there's three things in this episode that I already know are coming that are three of the funniest mm-hmm. things I've ever seen in a video. Yeah. I've got to pee. We're going to go take a, a picture. Jeremiah Watkins, Josh Adam Myers, back you to... You can win a shot with Christy. <laughs> go get a shot at the Evans. Oh, you want to fuck me? Oh, now you want to fuck me? You want to fuck me? Oh, now you want to fuck me? You fuck me? Back no, to me. our episode about our uh, the the ultimate decoy. Oh, yeah. Thud, dude. Thud. 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 Thud, not thud. thud. <laughs> what are we talking about? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Well, here he is. He's on the phone with a guy. He's already done multiple characters. He's going to meet up with this sad pedophile at a Circle K. And that's where we get back to Tomorrow Brian. might be 100% about his prank calls. <laughs> I don't <laughs> know. a whole week to dedicate to this guy. <laughs> KJ. All right. Are you... Yeah. All she got to do is just drop you off there. Yeah. Well, I'll be, I'll be that way. Yeah, all right. Take, yeah, take way. your time because there's a little right. bit of traffic up here. There's a little, little bit all of traffic. Right. So <laughs> I think rush. I should so make a your... stinky poop. Again, <laughs> yes, again, again over, again, over detailing yeah. and and I, not. Somebody and... has their hazard lights on ahead of me. Okay, I'm looking. I'm looking. Have yeah, you ever? It looks like he needs to jump. I'm gonna pull over for a second. <laughs> you know, in case they need to circle back around, take this. Uh, I'm gonna read out to you off their license plate number. <laughs> JLQ. <laughs> And he's P doing the face though. Yeah. He's, he's doing the, he's he's doing the flinch face though. Goes, I don't think they're triple A. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna fucking kill you. The registration's not on the license plate for some reason. I don't know. It's Why did they change the body on the Dodge Challenger? Fucking cocksucker. And the more rounded body was a throwback approach? Fucking scumbag. Also, there's no sports packet, so there's no spoilers. I feel like they don't have the kind of income that they need. Let me ask this guy a question. You son Hey, what's up, you hot girl? Is there a Hemi in this? There is. Are you hitting on somebody else while you're on the phone with me? No, I'm just very friendly. This guy's good. I think he's Lithuanian. <laughs> oh, right? no. It's Jason Statham. <laughs> I was just transporting something. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, my God. Look who just got hit by <laughs> Uber. It's the Terminator. <laughs> It's, it's the pitching coach from Major League. Yeah. Darn, give him the heater. Yeah. Oh my God, it's the manager. I love this British shit. Yeah, I'm I like moved to England. It's Danny. It's Danny Glover. Yeah. Get too old for this shit. <laughs> it's obscure. And they come in with their only with their catchphrases. Oh my God, it's Harvey Firestein. How you doing there, love? <laughs> I like the truck driver. Just goes. That's weird, everybody's in the <laughs> right, well, Anyway, I got the sheepskin comic. Well, how do you know Dudley Moore? <laughs> <laughs> how do you know who Dudley Moore <laughs> is? <laughs> yeah. Why did you make is it, a, a Is coach? this my Uber Lyft? <laughs> she was, uh, yeah. Why did you uh, make a reference to Coach on Cheers? <laughs> Hold you on were... a second. Mrs. Doubtfire is getting in the car. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh-huh. Hey, oh, what, hey. Are you, what are you hey, talking hey, about? Hey, wait, wait, wait a second. Are you saying that you're getting... Mrs. The character? Mrs. Doorflyer has gotten in your thing? Yes, yeah. it's a very weird coincidence. You fucking I'm gonna fucking kill you. I'm gonna murder you. I'm on ayahuasca. <laughs> so he hangs up, and then he hangs up, he hangs up, and he goes, all right, that guy's hook, line, and sinker. Let's go make a bust. <laughs> I'm surprised. I can hear that guy's, I can hear that guy's pecker through the phone. <laughs> I, can, I can feel the heartbeat through, through the speaker. I can hear his cock beating. I think my Catherine Blanchett got him. <laughs> he goes, oh, man, did he lose his mind when he learned out that Vietnam era Jane Fonda was in the car. <laughs> he goes, man, does he know? He goes, this sucking, ass, this young asshole thinks I got Burt Reynolds in here with I me. I think my Dame Judy Dench <laughs> really roped him in. <laughs> my Catherine Hepburn got him all hard. Even if he doesn't think I'm a 50-year-old girl no more, he's going to see if Judy Dench is in that car. <laughs> Sir Elton John. <laughs> You know, 12 minutes, figure 15 at most, and I'll see you soon. Looking forward to it. What are we going to do? What's the first thing you want to do? Grab that six years. Oh, that's so cute. And you promise me, like, you're not, you're not, you, you don't think I'm like, Immature. I mean, I have a fake ID. I told you that. We can go out drinking. No, a fake ID, by the way, also... Unnecessary. He, he, he tells all of them about this fake idea. He says he's trying. To, who gives a shit? I want to see a super. Yeah. I want to see a super match of him versus a <laughs> rational pedophile. So where he goes, oh, well, I don't know. I'm kind of more than the thirteen year olds also. <laughs> and he goes, "Oh, you son of a 
<laughs> I have we a got me. ID, so like, if you want to like stop and vote before we go fuck, that's cool. Yeah, no, I'm like totally registered to vote. I thought you were 16. Hey, I'm an organ donor. Do you want to go to a strip club or something? Do you want to be like um, the person who sits in the car with me to get my learner's permit? <laughs> <laughs> or what? Can you administer a driving test for me? <laughs> I'm going to be pulling up with a dual steering wheel car in mm. a can, bit. can I make you one of my references at Orange Julius at the mall? Is that okay goes, with you? Yeah, baby. I believe in a lady learning how to earn her own. <laughs> so, oh, oh, geez, I'm, I'm all oh. for teenagers in the workforce. <laughs> 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 Experience, you know. I think it's good for Figure you out guys. young what you, yes, figure out young what you want to do with yourself. You know what? You're lucky to have these jobs because the way this government's going, they're going to be exporting everything to damn immigrants. <laughs> pa- pa- she says, I don't really know if that's the policy. He goes, well, NAFTA was uh, not that great of a deal when we worked it. He goes, well, you're starting to sound like you don't love this country. I stand for my anthem. <laughs> The first go for it's great. I did some time in Afghanistan after the towers fell. <laughs> what? Just you know, that's, that's where me and Josh went with that for the next thing. We're just doing. Uh, he starts slipping up with the girl voice of all his adult things. Yeah. Yeah. Well, with my back lately, I really can't sleep my on a bed and slept down. Will you grab me a W nine tax form? <laughs> Dude, this guy's so great. So keep so keep going. Uh, Can we want to get. Do you have icy hot or something? I don't know. I just pulled something when I was walking around the. Sky. School, yeah, yeah I, my friends. I think I rolled my ankle stepping up the curb. <laughs> Did she just, or she just says, she just says subtle shit like that. Where she goes, F- I think the book was better. <laughs> I'm re-signing up for my VA benefits right now, but I'll yeah. call you later. I'm a huge fan of cream of wheat. <laughs> this Obamacare is actually harder to sign up for than you think. <laughs> Cobra doesn't cover a lot. How do you know about Co- Cobra Healthcare? Um, All right, let's just, um, <laughs> yeah, we could just keep doing this fake girl voice for an hour. Hey. Okay, all right, all right. So, all right. everybody gets mad at you. They're like, oh, you're a 16-year-old little brat. I'm like, I have a fake ID. I go drinking all the time. Hey, what a weirdo. So, okay, she's driving. All right, I'll see you then. Hell yeah, I'll see you Even soon he's then. tired Fuck of it, all the dude, details. Dude, we like, had it. it. Listen, we I have just want to get a hell yeah. We have to get that for like a Shane Gillis hell yeah. Dude, edit. Fucking, you're, this guy's putting his own videos out. Edit. You don't have to show all. Yeah, what were you going to say? Uh, uh, even he's getting tired of the details. He's like, all right, all right. I'm just, okay, I'll see <laughs> yeah, you there. Do you know what I mean? He hung, listen, up, he, went up, he hung up and went like this. <laughs> Young pussy talks. <laughs> it's a lot of yeah, brother. Man. When I was Young eight years old, I was really talk. into scrapbooking. And yeah, then he goes, I used to oh, man. Friend, I think this might have to be a this might have to be a scooting boot. <laughs> he goes, I might have to get like, on up. Oh, wait, wait but my sub's ready at the Circle K. I'll be right back. I'll see you when you get here. Hold okay? on, hold on. The guy at Circle K is talking to me. I'll let you get the phone. Wait, wait, wait. Before you go get your hot dog, wait. He's doing, he's wait, doing, wait, he's doing, wait, doing character. He's wait. doing it to get off the phone. Hey, Frank, get over here. Help me jump my car. I got to go, All right, sweetheart. Oh, shit, baby. He goes, oh, that guy, he's with a guy. He's with another guy. Wait, before you go, did I ever tell you at the time, my dad? Dad put his hands on my mom only one time, but I was there. And it's like, yeah. well, I don't want to hear all this. Oh man, this. you're making it weird. Christmas holds a special meaning to me because I was beaten. <laughs> I think I like you because I was molested by my uncle, and it's just nice to have it be somebody not in the family. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I gotta go. Uh, do, you mind, do you mind hitting no. me really hard while you do it? I hate myself. Yeah. You, uh, all right. Keep going, Christine. <laughs> All right, baby. All right, bye-bye. I think this is it. It's no wonder the bomb ain't got a car. He's a sexual predator, man. This guys, awareness is what we do this for. <laughs> Children's safety. Children's Social media safety. Is, my seatbelt is definitely on, y'all. Look at this. Y'all see this? Look, look. Oh. So you guys are an influence on me, too? What? So long. Yeah, who's proud of me? Yeah, you're also looking in a camera while driving, bro. <laughs> dude, non co- Dude, I could have told filming? you from the top this guy was a cigarette in his teeth kind of guy. Yeah. Yeah. Where he goes, well, yeah, where he puts it, his rod here. Between you. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So, yeah, what's up? Yeah. You guys proud of me? <laughs> it's like I smoke Parliament Light so I can put a little bit of Dapper Dan in the <laughs> filter and get a little <laughs> nummy. Definitely menthols. <laughs> yeah, 100%. Oh, yeah. Well, he, he, he had, had the pack of Newports. But this is years later, and he's definitely still oh, yeah. all straight menthols. I do camo crush. Where's my law enforcement family? Hell yeah. 
asking Nicole Putfark, or is it Putfark? Putfark, Putfark. I was just saying asking Nicole, because I can't pronounce it right. Law enforcement families, I'll tell you what, I got more respect for you guys than anything. You know, you guys are our first responders. You're the ones who put these guys away. I love you guys, man, for real. Cheers. Salute. <laughs> is it? Bear with me, guys. We're going to call this bastard person. This isn't the one. This is the one where he talks about the guy. This isn't the one where, he, where the guy, what the guy did. Yeah, what the guy did. I don't know. I don't know. It might be. Go right there. Go right there. Go back a little bit. Yeah, right. while he's driving. Yeah, go back. After this. There he goes. Rip that vape. <laughs> Rip the vape. <laughs> Oh, dude, he's got a vape in when he does the voice, and it fucks it up. Watch. Hello? Hi, Daddy. It says four minutes away. Are you there already? Yeah, I'm coming up there now. Okay, well, it still says I'm four minutes away, so we're almost there, okay? All right. All right. Thank you. What are you wearing? I'll be waiting. What are you wearing? A dark hoodie. Oh, cool. Like a dark blue. Cool. Because <laughs> I'm covering hedge. <laughs> yeah. he goes, uh, I don't know, man. I woke up. On I've got floor. one of those uh, ghillie suits on. I'm actually hiding in the wilderness right outside the circle. Goes, baby, baby, you I'm ain't gonna plain sight. You ain't gonna believe this, baby girl. But a magician gave me an invisible cloak. <laughs> So I am there, and I am also not there. What am I wearing? Everything and nothing. I hate to get existential on you. <laughs> Emperor's new clothes. You get it. <laughs> Let me see. I'm wearing a skirt because it's cold. Um, what, what? Well, not because it's cold, but I'm wearing a skirt. Stop, he fucked like up. Ah! <laughs> Did he really? Whoop, okay. whoop, whoop. He goes, I'm wearing it. He goes, I'm wearing a skirt because it's cold, not because it's cold. Fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. Well, right here, right here, but. I'll tell you what, he really makes Wawa his fucking hub, the yeah. Florida Wawas, which I believe there probably are a lot of pedophiles in that. <laughs> <laughs> the place is a fucking Petri dish of pedophiles. It's a cess, the whole thing's a cesspool. <laughs> it's, it's just great sandwiches and dudes who fuck kids. My uncle built Wawas. Yeah. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. Skirt because it's cold. Um, well, not because it's cold, but I'm wearing a skirt because I can. Well, um, let me see. I'm wearing like a white shirt girl, with ruffles man. around the collar. And, well, you'll, you, you won't be able to I'm dressed like a 15th century queen. I have ruffles around my collar right now. I'm wearing, um, a marble. train. I'm wearing a... A Kahlua shirt? Damn it. That's what it is. That's what he goes, he goes, that's what I'm actually wearing. God damn it. <laughs> Kahlua. Kahlua. Kahlua shirt? Yeah. These new Tommy John underwear I just got, they're yeah. good. They keep your berries and twigs separate. I got diesel jeans on. And I'm smoking. Oh, God, God that yes. damn it, Shane. That's yeah. me. Oh, me, I'm ripping a Newport, and I'm wearing a sick-ass Ed Hardy shirt with like some sort of a demon panther face on it. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, this guy... Is great. Are you, All right. Are we gonna hang out maybe tonight too? Huh? Do you want to hang out tonight too? Like maybe this is it then. Probably. Still possible. Yeah. We can hang out every day if you want. Okay, that's too much. This guy really is. I'm telling you, pause. If he was a real woman and this was legal, it's all above water. This guy is unbearable. This woman's unbearable. His character he's making. Yeah, you'd have to, you'd have to really want to break the law, fuck a child, and be horny as shit. Dude, you have to, to be, get through all of this. You have to be bull horny. You have to be like in a fucking stable, ready to bust <laughs> mate. Just like kissing, <laughs> kicking the side. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's like, before, let him go. Kick him. Before we get the conversation, take our last no. break here. No. Right, how? Buddy, it's zinging. God damn it, dude. Wait till you guys see. There's just this one story that I, I do believe is next. We'll find out. It's the funniest the thing in the entire series. To me. Oh, well, I don't know. that. There's a lot. Uh, this is a long series. Yeah. <laughs> to me, though, this is what hooked me. This joke that's coming next, if it's in this episode, is what hooked me 100% to be like. Joke? I mean, what we're going to make a joke oh, of. Oh, oh, yeah. The oh, story yeah, yeah, the guy yeah. tells. Yes. It's, a, I, it's fucking hilarious. We'll find it for sure. Um, we'll be right back here. We're hanging out with Jeremiah Watkins. You can download and- his podcast, Jeremiah Wonders, uh, spot, uh, Apple, Spotify, all that. All the platforms, well, All the platforms, dude. All the platforms, dude. bro. And, and YouTube. You, and YouTube. And you can also download The 500 with Josh Adam Myers, who just had a fucking legendary interview today. Big one today. Neil deGrasse Tyson, dude. Woo. That's right. So go download The 500 and Jeremiah Wonders. And then and, he ascended. And get tickets to The Stand. <laughs> uh, it's a Big J show, The the Worst, which I'll be on on Thursday at 10 p.m. A rare Dan Soder stand-up appearance. Hey, shut up, dude. I do stand-up every night. 
I'm just not on the road. Why are you doing that to me? I thought, I'm trying to avoid chicken sandwiches. I'm trying to sell tickets. Oh, yeah. I'll <laughs> only do it at 10 o'clock on Thursday, and then I'm walking away from the game. That's goes, it, bro. What are you doing, dude? Don't fuck <laughs> it. He goes, dude, this is how you promote it. I go, I got, <coughs> All right, right. that's why I'm doing that show tonight in Brooklyn, so I can get that chicken sandwich. <laughs> what are you doing? Is there a chicken sandwich in Brooklyn you're getting? Oh, man. Pies and thighs? You're right there? Ooh, that what? just sounds bomb. They do, sounds a chicken, they do a chicken sandwich, like a chicken biscuit. It's biscuits with honey on it. And then um, a chicken, uh, like, buffalo sauce. Like, And then it's on with... Oh, it's unbelievable. Oh, Fuck, I'm really? salivating. Doing a show out there? Yeah, I'm doing a show. I'm doing a show at Baby's All Right, which is down the street from this place. And then I'll get show that. you my chicken biscuit. That sounds... I'm not going to lie, dude. You actually do a good Shane doing... Jennifer? You, you do a good mm-hmm. Jennifer. Thank you. It's, it's you know <laughs> it's what I mean. Good. It's the closest. It sounds yeah. the closest to all of us. Oh man! All right, and don't forget bonfire live holiday. Did it make show. you hard or something? That was where you're like, okay. oh man, that was good. <laughs> you look over. You look over. Yeah. And you just go. What are you doing later, dude? I'm blowing you. Yeah, I go, oh, boy, this is really good. I go, you guys. You guys think yeah, you can get shade on the phone? Get a little free I, don't, I don't care if you only have new 15 minutes. Give it to oh, me. Oh, 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 I, can, I can accept all 15. I'll, I'll take I your go, guest spot. This is how these, I go, This is how these guys walk into it. Because I'll tell you what, I'm willing to drive and go meet up with this girl. <laughs> she, wants to hear my, she wants to hear my new 15? Dude, I got a new 15. I'll take your after special dirty material. Right, oh, fuck. I can't, I can't get it up. All right, we're going to take a break. The stuff that wasn't ready for TV. <laughs> Not ready for primetime time. <laughs> All right, we're going to be right back. It's the bonfire. Hanging out with Josh Adam Myers and Jeremiah Watkins. <clears throat> Um, we have found out, in fact, that the video we've been watching is the correct one. It is the correct one. No worries there. And when we get through this uh, and the confrontation, we will... Uh, one more thing that we have to show, for sure. But, uh, I mean, we're, we're desperately running out of time. There's so much to talk about. Let's just play this, Clint. <laughs> yeah. Let's just play this. Oh, this please. is one of my favorite things. You know what I mean? Like, think that I'm annoying either. Like, if you enjoy my oh, company, anything I get, or think that I'm immature because I'm 16. Like, I have, I am very, very talented in every way, shape, or form. So I'll see you soon, okay? Uh, all right. All right. Bye. All right. Bye. Bye. Guys, uh, sounds like where's Waldo's cousin, man? What, is that, what does that I mean? I don't get that at all. What the fuck does that mean? Nobody knows what Where's Waldo even sounds like. Yeah. Uh, sounds, right. The guy sounds like Where's Waldo's cousin. Yeah. To him. I, I found Waldo, and I know his cousin. I've been playing that game for years. He goes, listen, dude, this guy sounds like he eats green eggs and ham. That's what this guy sounds like. All of his Where's Waldo books have somebody else circled? Yeah. yeah. That's Where's Waldo's cousin. That's goes, his uncle. I know the whole operation. Waldo <laughs> down. You think, it, you think it's just right Waldo? Down. This he guy's goes, one fish, two fish, blue fish, new fish. <laughs> he goes, this, and listen, when I tell you that I pulled the string of Waldo and what came undone, it will blow your mind. He goes, Waldo, a cog in the machine. <laughs> Dug deep. He's a really proletarian. He got to the nit grit of this whole thing. Dude, uh, um, here it comes. This yeah, is my well, I said, well, That was a, something, a words we texted back and forth this week at some yeah. point. <laughs> where's Waldo? You sound like where's Waldo's cut. There's not even words in the book. No, <laughs> it's a picture book. outside of the cover that says "Where's yeah. Waldo." That's it. Really, that's about it. And maybe whoever they dedicated the book to maybe the blue white, one. Maybe I some, think the blue one has very little maybe words. Maybe some in faint it. writing on like a building or something inside know. the book. But it, but let's be honest. When you saw those in the book fair when you were in elementary school and you walked in and saw the yeah. words Waldo, they got the blood flowing. Yeah, but this again, guy knows this guy knows his, uh, his fucking demo. <laughs> again, he can edit all this as much as he wants. Down, these are his edited together videos. Well, here's what he edits. Why in would the, he leave in? Why would he go? He goes. Wow, you sound like an asshole. When you why say that would shit? he leave in this next part? Is beyond. Me. He wants you to know how much he's willing to suffer for his art. To hit play. You know what the unfortunate part about this is? Is this is somebody's father, or this is somebody's grandfather? What? And you dumb son of a bitches didn't teach him that child predatorial nature is wrong. What? Nah, for real. The bad part about this is this man would. Be with a 16 year old girl, a 15 year old girl. Last time it was a 15 year old girl. If you remember, this is the man that was masturbating on the phone. And we were trying to get him to come down to Tampa. Trying to get him to come to Tampa. We were trying to get him to come. He did his thing on the phone, which really made me disgustingly. 
and then hung up and they didn't answer any of my text messages or any of my calls for weeks. He goes hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> hilarious. This dude came and had a change of heart. Yeah. yeah. This guy came like, and was like, what am I doing? Jerking exactly. off with a Come child on the phone? Come on, brother. What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> get together, Darren. And here's God, like, get damn it. Together, Come on, man. Here's my problem with this fictional girl, all right? This girl is young. She's impressionable. Why would he ghost a good girl like this? Yeah, this girl I mean, needs to be yeah. Come on. <laughs> she says she's talented. Everything. <laughs> Everything that this man could want. Yeah, dude, that's so You're funny. You're breaking it on. <laughs> this guy fucking came and snapped right out of it. And he was like, what am I doing? That made me laugh and so hard. Like, that. And then I hunted him down for well, weeks. Here, here it is, because here's the play. He goes, he, we couldn't get a hold of him for weeks. And then this, this next part. And sent him a message. Well, just posted an ad in his little general vicinity. He hangs out in a certain app called Moco Space. You ever seen that one? No. You no. ever seen Moco Space? No. Yeah, that's a predatorial app, too. Ooh, there it is. This is him. <laughs> this is him, yes. There it is. Put in the wrong way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> This guy's just constantly smoking. Oh, look at the rings. I like get dude. A fucking... Come on. A self-sting operation <laughs> job is never done. He's got like a Live Strong bracelet on. <laughs> Lost a nut. 97. Yeah, I'm back, though. Better than ever. <laughs> <laughs> One nut doing the job of two. It's fine. Still come batches. I mean, big guy. blast, man. I mean, real face covers. <laughs> We're uh, talking storage bins. Let's just go to him confronting the pervert. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is, that's, it's here. Right here. Sorry, the person you were trying to reach has a voice. There it is. He's not answering now because he's probably second guessing it immediately. Also, pause it. One of these videos, we're not going to find that, but one of these videos you'll see as you watch them, uh, the people listening at home. Oh, like he's so obvious. He just like drives in circles around the gas tanks of a Wawa constantly while he's telling them to meet him at Wawa. And then people will be like, yeah, I'm just a little nervous to hang out here, man, because I see a guy like driving in circles <laughs> around this Wawa on the phone the whole time. And it just seems weird. I think I'm going to go. He's like, no, don't leave. I'll tell him to come back. That's probably just a crazy guy. In the- That's, That's just a crazy guy in a Dodge Challenger. He goes, I didn't say it was a Dodge Challenger. <laughs> uh, I mean, really? oh, oh, damn. He goes, damn it. Oh, I'm so horny for you. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, wrong voice. Oh, Fuck. Oh, God damn it. Shift it. Got gear switch. <laughs> yeah, baby. It's my <laughs> Oh, it's I'm so wet again. If there's ever any footage of him getting into a massive accident while he's in the middle of doing the girl voice. <laughs> the voice is unbelievable. Baby, I just go, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> fuck, 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 fuck. He goes like this. He's like, baby, I'm hydroplaning. I'm hydroplaning. I'm hydroplaning. Can't get control. Turn it. Yo, fuck face. Do I turn into the steer? I turn into the steer. Yo, no. I thought you were a trucker. What's up, baby? He is just leaning upside down right now. He may be. You're waiting on the jaws of life. <laughs> like, sir, supply. are you injured? I'm a girl. Say I'm a girl. Goes, I got Bro, do me a favor before you cut this roof off this car. <laughs> you back up to I'm a girl. Goes, <laughs> now it goes, all right, then back up a few feet. What if you don't mind? He goes, oh, my God, I'm here. Yeah. I can't believe a little girl like you is stuck in a car. <laughs> Can you please help me out? He goes, you're very pretty, you know. Oh, the jaws of life. I guess you, you were 24 <laughs> years old, possibly. You look super talented. You may be here in front. He said I'm 24. He goes, he's definitely a lower vertebrae. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, no, nah, the legs are nothing. <laughs> no, nah, the legs are nothing right now, man. I'm telling you. This is gonna be this is gonna be a lengthy stay. This is gonna be a recovery. <laughs> Baby, will you wait for me? You promised to wait for me. Wait for me. Out of the hospital. Baby, I can't feel my legs. Can you come pick me up? Oh man, here we go. Here's seen severed spine. Here's him, here's him confronting. It was a clean break. I'll never walk again. Here's him confronting the pervert. <laughs> Robert, do me a favor. Stand down, Robert. Stand down. Do not make any sudden movements. I'm going to ask you a question, Robert. Robert, Rob, just for the record, who's listening at home, Robert has no ability to make sudden movements. <laughs> Robert also looks like It took every... Robert 15 minutes to pour a coffee yeah. without burning his Rob, hands. Robert looks like every single one of my friend's stepdads <laughs> yeah. after 60 years old. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, he's just gnawing on a small he, cigarette. He, he just came from off-track betting. Like, yeah. He goes, the ponies is not doing well today. What? <laughs> what? Sudden movements? <laughs>
Yeah, he's got the glasses. <laughs> yeah, hey, pardon. Hey, I'm here to pick up my daughter's friend. I will say <laughs> this. The... You know they're always like lonely, and what they assume. I guess these are guys. I really believe that a lot of them have not fucked other kids before, on a lot of these pedophile things. I'm telling you, because the chance of I'm not saying it doesn't happen. Obviously, it does, but the chance of it working out, like these guys' belief, you have to make them believe that a young, pretty girl that they're sending pictures of wants to fuck an old, crusty. These guys don't show up like looking their best. I they like, show up like I the like way they would your go. your hair, baby. <laughs> and they're delusional enough to believe like, yeah, well, she clearly wants the good yeah, shit. Nothing gets me wetter than a guy that looks like he sleeps on a futon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's like, can I, what's that? Uh, I got a shot here playing. Cause mm-hmm. I love whiskey idiot. breath. This guy's an idiot. <laughs> What's your old ass doing out here, man? Who are you here to meet, Rob? Be honest. Be honest and don't make any sudden movements, please. Rob, be honest, man. Don't be a liar. Rob, don't advance on me. Not yet. Listen to me. I'm going to ask you one time. I'm going to ask you to tell the truth. And listen, you tell me the truth, things go way easier, Rob. They go a lot easier. Okay. You're here to meet a young lady, aren't you? Don't uh, tell uh, lie to me. Don't fucking told lie to me. me. To meet her up here. Okay, she told you to meet her up here, right? But I didn't. If 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 somebody told you to go shove your head up an ostrich's uh, ass, you gonna do it? What's great is this I guy's get so a good look at a bull by sticking my head up the butcher's ass, but no, I no the bull. it's got it's oh, gotta God. be your bull. He tries to be clever. With a guy that's clearly borderline special needs. Yeah. This guy's like, a okay, lady, uh, I lady came you. up here and told me to <laughs> come up. And he goes, yeah, is that so? Well, uh, play me out, Sam, because this is Casanova. <laughs> he goes, I don't understand. What does that mean? I'm lonely. My wife Peggy died. I don't understand the cable television. I thought she would show me how to use it. My son was struck by a car <laughs> when he was nine. And he goes, oh, Yeah. Yeah, well... I need someone to help me. I have all these remotes. Living La Vida Loca, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Am I right? I know where your, <laughs> your mindset's at, Rob. You can't spell uh, Circle K without <laughs> Circle Jerk. You know what I'm saying, hey. Rob? What you got, sucker! <laughs> she, she told me she's 18. I know she was told. Oh, she told you she was 18? Yeah. All right, so not only are you a pedophile, not only... No. Let me tell you something. Even worse! A lying to a stranger. <laughs> I got Even it. worse than pedophile. <laughs> he goes, listen, lying to I a understand. You've never met. He goes, I understand if you're a pedophile. You got you're into different things. But to lie about it. To look another man right in his face. What are you doing? To look a man through this cloud of vape. A man <laughs> that can do dope shit <laughs> like this. <laughs> <laughs> You know what hurts the most? It's not that you're a pedophile. It's not that you treat this girl like a piece of meat garbage. It's just it. <laughs> Side shot. <laughs> he goes, and yes, before you're going to ask me, that is a grape jelly mix. <laughs> it's called jelly lemon pie. He goes, get in line. I make it myself. I make it myself in my drip Take factor. Take a call for that, and I'm also my prank call you later. <laughs> I'm prank call you later. Ask you you have Prince Albert in the can. <laughs> I hope it's just the most bait. Every one of them is that. Uh, Mike Hunt, please. <laughs> yeah. Sir, I know this game. Mike Hunt. <laughs> Sir, I'm not going to ask over the last people for Mike Hunt. Miss, please, Mike Hunt. <laughs> How many if I ask you? <laughs> I don't know. Well, go ahead. It's not her calling, Rob. It's not her. I can guarantee you. It's his <laughs> ring. This is her. <laughs> I don't know who that is. You want to? You, this you is can my uh, uh, Hannah Montana ringtone. I have no idea what <laughs> you're talking about. Don't know sudden movements. Oh, what a night! <laughs> <laughs> Dude, this guy really is dumb to the point where he's like, he's not a threat. No, this guy. I mean, he's well, clearly he's like, a pedophile, which is you know a big problem. That's but, threatening. In its own way, it's threatening. It's threatening. <laughs> it's threat. It's there. And you know, if you think about it, really, there's a threat there. It's such a weird. <laughs> it's just such a weird meetup of a guy that is. Because just why? Go further into it, where he really basically can't do anything. My daughter would fuck this geezer up. I don't, oh, I don't like feeling bad for that guy. Yeah, like, I don't want to feel bad for a pedophile. But, but Shane's such a knob that such like a dildo. I'm like, uh, like I feel like he, these guys were tricked. But I'm like, eh, you were looking for young. That's puss. right, Coil. You think he's Take my girl, G to Gent. 
Come try. I hope he does. Yeah. And he gets her. Oh, dude, she's she's the field producer. <laughs> she's running around. I need you to sign a release, Rob. I know you're a piece of shit. But you got to sign a release. Rob, I'm gonna show you. My man busted you fair and square. You get so busted. You're not even going to jail, dude. You're just gonna be like a fucking. Per- you're just, you're just well, go ahead because that's what he does. He, he can't threaten them with jail time. Mm-hmm. He can't do anything. No, and like this. This is and all this will be thrown out anyway. Jump to that. I this, wish isn't, you would. this isn't uh, uh, reading Rainbow where you say, hey, you know what? I messed up and now I didn't. You're a motherfucking scumbag. And I'm going to tell you that what, right he, now. Did you never see Reading Rainbow? I, I, I don't think that's the plot of Reading Rainbow. Reading Rainbow, Rainbow you know, where they, they turn Read criminals book. into good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, where well, you think you could be a pedophile. Well, Isn't Reading Rainbow you could be a pedophile one minute and the next yeah. minute not a pedophile? You think you could be butterfly in the sky? I could fly so high? <laughs> he goes, listen, Jordy from Star Trek didn't teach you, right? <laughs> Just read a book and take a look. <laughs> Just reading <laughs> Rainbow. Hold on, I got Aaron Neville calling. <laughs> hey, what's going on? <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. In the sky. This is a beautiful young woman you're going to have sex with today. <laughs> I'm proud to tell you that I'm Aaron Neville. She's, She's really talented. Hair. She just picked hair off my jean I vest. can buy you she so high. high. <laughs> She's got a lot of talent. She'd be surprised. Yeah, uh, You'd he, be surprised. Just watch the end of this because he's, he's doing that. He goes, apparently you don't know that this is trading places because I'm Dan Aykroyd and you're Eddie Murphy. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> what does it mean? You're down on your no luck does. now. Yeah. No one knows. That's the thing. No one beats the Wiz. <laughs> this is the Nobody movie. Beats the wits. Beats the wits. Nobody beats the Wiz. Nobody beats the Wiz. The old guy looks like that actor. He was actually nominated Abe for Abe Vigoda. No, I was going to say. Uh, he does Ri- look a lot like Ri- Abe Vigoda. But also Richard Jenkins, like the the father. I mean, he's been in a whole bunch of shit. He's in the I station know, agent. Yeah. Oh, Dick Jenkins. Yeah, Dicky J. <laughs> Little oh. Dick J. Little Dicky J. DJ. <laughs> Dicky Double I feel J. bad for this guy, man. You're not supposed to. He's a pedophile. I, That's yeah, how big I, of an asshole I, this guy is. I was just trying to, to babysit a girl, okay? <laughs> yeah. I, I'm lonely. You don't feel bad. The guy's a piece of shit. But uh, again, like, this guy goes way out of his way to like hook him into doing a thing he let a guy jerk off on the phone with him that is the funniest that's thing in commitment. the world to me. I mean, that, that is, is so fucking thing. funny he goes it made me sick each and every time <laughs> as he came over and over to my fantastic talk throughs <laughs> we had different scenarios me and the girl I went to high school with me and the more mature softball coach he had to work, he had to work on other girl voices he goes, he goes I'm looking at pussy right now because oh that's good baby <laughs> yeah oh, that's real good yeah it's an older I told you I like older people oh yeah get in there get them open open them up with your fingers first <laughs> yeah you need them with your tongue oh we're not, not right on it not right on it work the outside of the hood uh, work the outside of the hood <laughs> the hood the hood let's the hood. watch the end of this work the outside of the hood because he gets back in his car and fucking <laughs> gets stoked like he just killed a fucking like a trophy piece hit play shit don't happen it don't happen on my watch oh like, you hear me you understand uh-huh. where I'm coming from. I want you to tell me, number one, tell me that you're sorry. I'm sorry. Tell me that you're a scumbag. I'm a scumbag. That's right, man. <laughs> you really are. You're a sexual predator and you've been exposed. Rob, I'm you're sorry. free to leave at any time. And one, I'm not holding you here, man. I'm just telling you that the facts of life. And this is the life that... I'm just that- sitting on a corner talking <laughs> shit to a fucking piece of shit. Oh, yeah, it's why I don't mind, like, we're going to get these li- views bumped up a lot, but I don't mind that because, like, these guys are, scu- yeah, fuck them at the end of the day. I mean, yeah. if you show up for it, dude, you show up for, you know. Yeah, a piece of shit. I- 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 I'd be like, I-, I don't know if you need to get an ongoing investigation of the guy if he- after he whacked off and, like, was like, what the fuck am I doing? You know what I mean? But it's like, uh, well, like, like this guy now, it's like, get- like, fuck him. This guy, if you- we'll just watch him get back in the car because it's hilarious. Your kind is not well, wanted. Else, okay, you're not going to meet anybody else? Yes, needs to go get a bridge game or a Parcheesi board, hang out with the neighbors, play some play some cards or chess. Oh, yeah, they got, got kids. kids. Not the kids. <laughs> they got kids there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, the Janie on the corner's got a beautiful brand. He's got to amend all of his statements. He goes, yeah. what did I say? God damn it, did I say kids? <laughs> that set you off, didn't Hang it? out with the neighborhood kids. Bring them into your house where you have safe spaces. Go, go Stick walls. Go, go to your neighbor's house, play shoots and ladders with the kids. Wait, no, forget <laughs> about goes, that. Do you, mind, do you mind if I get one more? <laughs> he goes, you want me to want me to get you there one more time? He goes, please. <laughs> he goes, before he you put on the internet, give me one more, baby. He goes, all right, here we go. Let me get the character. <clears throat> he daddy. He daddy. <clears throat> <clears throat> 
Hey, Daddy. <clears throat> Sorry, I've been chaining him today. <laughs> <He> goes, <laughs> uh, it's, uh, that, it's that new van- <laughs> vanilla cream custard bacon. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's really was, got a bubble in my throat. Got it from Japan. In the answer to your question, it is delicioso. Goes down smooth, comes out. All right, here we go. What am I wearing? A little fizzy thing. Pushing them away. Him in, the, the him in the parking lot fucking talking dirty to him one last time before he walks off is just the funniest thing in the world. Also, how do we know that this guy's 59? He looks way older yeah, than 59. Yeah, he looks mid-60s. He doesn't oh, question yeah. anything for real. He yells at them and oh, sends them on their way. This guy, could, he would have put it up. He goes, he goes, disgusting 29-year-old. Come. <laughs> Bro, also, you look really bad for your age, dude. He just believes everything. God, just, just show him getting back in the car. Yeah, yeah I, I, well, show him back and then we'll wrap up the show. We'll watch the other part tomorrow. I, I don't, right there. The, Jacob, I can already see your production head getting uh, fucking steam come out of your ears. We got to watch one more clip tomorrow of this guy. We'll do it in the second hour, in the salacious hour. Ah! No, we got it. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. All right. On people that deserve to be flipped on. This man deserves to be put in a prison and just forgotten about. Literally. Okay? You got to you gotta really, Instead, really, really... I have mildly inconvenienced his day. I may be, I may be, made him miss one of his programs. I have taken 45 minutes out of this man's life. He will never get back. I have also put 300 miles on my <laughs> Mazda. 300 miles? I have to listen to a man masturbate to my voice over and over again. Uh, For what? He knows. He goes... Yeah, you know, he's like, I I, you got you to gotta love your work, you know? Because of this job, I haven't been able to pay my rent in six months. I've <laughs> been evicted, but I inconvenienced that man's life. Listen, I'm not the hero Wawa needs, but I'm the hero <laughs> Wawa, Wawa deserves. <laughs> he's Wawa Batman. I think, wouldn't it be funny if we <laughs> find totally out Wawa Shane Batman. Coyle, that, uh, like Jennifer Coyle, his voice, uh, has an Amazon wish list that guys keep buying him stuff on, <laughs> and it's just stuff for him. He goes... To a spit, a split fire spark plugs. He goes, oh, I don't know, probably a new Fender ramp. <laughs> I got a winged axe at home. Definitely a new fate mod. The guys, just like something dudes would have. He goes, a kiss pinball machine. <laughs> uh, one of those axe throwing boards. Oh, man, I'm talking a full badass oh, standing dude. arcade yeah. game. Condition ColecoVision. He goes, bowling alley. You can put it on there. <laughs> Someone might buy it. Look. No one's probably going to get it, but somebody might come through and buy the thing. <laughs> Dude, Jeremiah Watkins, Josh Adam Myers, thank you guys for coming by. It's always uh, great. Guys, I know it's the end of the show, but I just have to let you know in this rabbit hole we've been in, there's an entire Facebook page called The Thoughts of Shane Coyle at Shane's Crazy Mind. Oh, we'll see you tomorrow, everybody, with this in because this is going to be a whole new thing. thought process. Oh, he's sober now. <laughs> Yeah, dude. It hasn't gotten better. Told you he was on Oxys. Oh, yeah, for sure. What the fuck did we find? Yeah, we found a genius. We found our Eldorado. Uh, It's just uh, like you just found the Beatles catalog. (laughs) You know what? 13 albums? I'll take a peek at Twitter and everything today, and you let us know. Just a little tidbit of some of the things coming our way. He seems to have have posted a Facebook Live conversation with our good friend Aaron Carter. Yep. Crazy. Um, we, we just, it's just nonstop. That I supplied milk. Man, was it you or your husband that posted pictures of my, that actually sent me emails? No, no, no. When you Wait, admit that, it's disparagement. It's defamation of character. It's slander. Listen, Jake. All I want your you husband, I want your husband to text the list of names. Of you back up. Okay. Now, I told you. Well, listen, Shane. Shane. Yeah. I'm nervous because our guest is coming in. You're not nervous. I'm very nervous. Why do you think he's going to recognize you from his thing? <laughs> I go, hey, dude, can you take episode 37 now? Dan, why are you putting on a weird voice this whole show? I just haven't talked to Jennifer in a while. What? What? <laughs> <laughs> <gasps> 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 I go. Do, should we say all right, when we come back from break? Before he comes in, we got to talk about some of the the prep notes we have. Yeah, we have to set it up. Yeah, because I, it's got to be to make sure we're paying attention. Like green M and M's, what was sent to us. Do you know what I mean? Like, no green M&M's. We're just seeing if you're paying attention. Mm-hmm. It's got to be that. Or we'll find out. He's sitting where Jacob is because we have to have an equidistance. Yeah. Plus, we want to see if he smells pedophile on Jacob's chair. Yeah, he's like, who's sitting there? And then when we go on break, when we go on break, we should awkwardly have DJ Lou hit on Becky, hit on B-Rod. And be like, Becky, what are you getting for your 15th birthday? Yeah. He goes, I'll tell you what, I'd like to get you a mustache ride. I if, I could, if I could just grow a mustache, when's your birthday? Yeah. 
Look at my dick, dude. It's like rock hard right now. It's rock hard right now. <laughs> dude, I'm so excited. I'm still getting excited for Shane Cole to come in. He's, he's here in 15 minutes. I know. So we let's let's prep right now on air, and then we'll take a break and we'll come back and I'll be here. Okay. What are we going to ask? I have no idea. I have a thousand questions and no questions. I don't know. <laughs> what about the text Black Lou had? <laughs> oh, well, you have this. Yes, so we could go through all that. Here's no, what about the, all the stuff that he said when he was like... Yes, these, some of these things are on here. What I'm about saying. the main one that I'm talking about? The green M&Ms. He, no. No. Um, but we, he does say that we have the ability, if we'd like to... To call Aaron Carter live on the air to discuss the anti-bullying campaign they have together, which I'd be very happy to do if he will also just bag on Fell Dog with us. <laughs> yeah. Um. Oh yeah, it does say it on this thing in bold print. Um. Is it? I, this is the thing. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna ask to see proof. I'm gonna have to see whoever he feels comfortable with. A fellow female like B Rod can take a look, or. <laughs> B Rod, you might have to see what am I looking at? some ge- some genitalia. Shane, mm, he's the ultimate he said, decoy. But here's the thing: he's also a, a guy who's got a, a thing, you know, the prank mafia. This is a, it's a, it's a decent prank to say this, but he's saying that he is a female to male transgender. That's why his female voice is so good. I don't know. Is that something that he just said and then Lou wrote down and then he doesn't know that we're going to write it down and then we're going to ask him about it? And he's like, oh, that's just some bullshit. That's some crazy shit. That probably makes the most sense yeah. to what's going on. Yeah. <clears throat> However, dude, if he pulls out a fucking a doctor made dick. Oh, dude, if he has an aisle of Dr. Moreau penis. That'd be crazy. It's like he pulls his dick out and it's got a little, it's got one eye and a mouth and he goes, kill me, kill me, kill me. Every day is pain. Every day is pain. I am the ultimate decoy. <laughs> Please end this. Oh my God. <laughs> Shoot his fucking dick. You shot my dick, man. You shot my fucking dick. You shot my dick. You got my dick. I got so excited. <laughs> I saw two gentlemen walk in. Where's Jacob? Jacob? Is he getting decoyed? Oh, there he is. Jacob. I thought he was getting decoyed right it's now. It's cold weather. It's back to special Jacob coffee. Ooh. Hot coffee. Jacob coffee Shut. season. Black Lou, we brought up in the Roman. notes. Black Lou, this was sent in text. Yes. That he is a female to male transgender. Yes, that was sent through text. So he it meant says to the type. word. I saw the text. It says the word seriously after it, but he's also the prank mafia. So Exactly. You know, I mean, who knows? That's what I think the question has to you know, be. Who unchip clipped us? Uh, it's been unclipped all show. I don't like that. Treating us like chumps. Nah, it was on. It was on. It was on. It was unclipped. He says we can call Aaron Carter live on air to talk about the anti-bullying campaign, but I've got so many other Aaron Carter questions. Um, I definitely want to know what his thoughts are now after the show of Fell Dog yes, for sure. Yes. I, I got an outside feeling Shane Coyle knows Corey Feldman. Do you think they bumped in the same circles? Just both, somehow. Both trying to end pedophilia? Both of them are, yeah. Yeah, both of them are trying to end pedophilia. Um, yeah, he's got the ch- the child predator hunting movement on Facebook. Yeah, bro. Now, oh, remember, campers, call in 844-COMEDY-9 and ask him what he's highly trained in. Yes. Because yes. I can't just come up and ask that question without looking like a dickhead. So call in 844-COMEDY-9. You can be anybody. I hope he says like, Kempo and then just fucking hits you. <laughs> I can't breathe. <laughs> Jay? B Rod, can you come over to the microphone for a second? B Rod, get over here. Now, get over here, B Rod. He, he says he started the Facebook. Uh, Hello, Becky Rodriguez. Or, he said he started the Predator. It's me, hunt- your husband. Sorry. <laughs> he said he started the uh, predator, child predator hunting movement on Facebook, which is a movement. Again, what I, I, the questions I have for that are like Does this get things done? Mm-hmm. Does it just humiliate people, or are you stopping pedophiles from actually having real charges? Brought Great question them? that you should ask them. Uh, I, I could see how it would do good in the thing, but you really got to have like your audience be a little bit larger for this. I feel like uh, maybe we can help in that being the case. But you say uh, someone sent you, Becky. Yeah, my editor Tanner sent me a Canadian pedophile hunter. Whoa! And he does the voice, but really not as well. And it's awesome that the guy still believes him. 
Is it a bad version? It's so bad, and it starts immediately. Like you don't even have to set it up. This is perfect. During, yeah, he said he believed I'm a 14 year old child during which I collected a substantial amount of intel relating to alleged child molestation and other possible crimes. Send two to three months. By the way, here come two to three months. <laughs> I chatted with a mid 30s man. Oh, please, someone else uh, after the highly trained. Uh, also, ask if he's listened to Men Jerk Off. Please, oh, someone ask that. We I'll can't ask, ask that. Uh, okay. I have we'll, no problem We'll see if the rapport... I just wanted to know if the rapport was good enough for us just to get that question off. I mean, that seems like a fair question to ask. It is a very fair question to ask. So, Asking wait, this is... That. Sorry, back to the Canadian ultimate decoy. I wouldn't call him that. Who, this guy? Yeah. No, this is the... This is like SAS to the The Marines. Canadian one, but I want to yeah. see the... I want to see his voice. Yeah. Mid 30s man through video Skype, text, and video recorded phone calls. He believed that I was a 14 year old child, during which I collected a substantial amount of intel related to alleged child molestation and other possible crimes. It looks like fucking Negan. The videos I show you, yeah. more so this one. I hope to give you an inside, never before seen look at their grooming process. Also, I'm uploading this video in the hopes that the mother He also of that used child poor uh, punctuation. Was up to. He used bad punctuation in his own video. I'll put it in your butt, y'all. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, bud. Hey, bud. You you're going to get a good one, bud. You come around here, you're going to get a real fucking... <laughs> you're going to get a good one. Oh, oh right. yeah. My name's I'm Jennifer. A... Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's why no. his voice is that be good. He goes, oh, yeah, no. My name's Vanessa. <laughs> and you know what? I'm about to squirt a hot load of Tim Hortons all over the floor. <laughs> yeah. Oh, me? I like a good steak. You know, some mashed potatoes. <laughs> uh, no, I'm here. <laughs> this is on the phone. Yeah? Yeah, what, what'd yeah. you say, bud? Still me, bud. Yeah, <laughs> still, still me, me, bud. Little Lisa. Little, Little Lisa. Tiffany. Oh, no, I'm scared of the dark. Yeah, eh? So, oh, yeah. I guess play with your big meat? Yeah. <laughs> oh, throw your slab on the table. I'll lick it up, I will. Yeah. You want, you probably would, you rather me look like I'm 14, you rather I'm look that I, that I look like I'm 14 years old, though. <laughs> they just make him oh, he smoker's it. hack and then show a picture of the guy. Yeah. He goes, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this guy, uh, dude, that's hilarious. Steve O's, is, a, Steve O's a Canadian yes. pedophile. Hey, what's up, everyone? For my next thing, I'm gonna fuck this kid over the phone. Like, I'm, I'm Steve O, and this is fucking children. <laughs> hey, what's up? This is Steve O, and this is pedophilia on roller skates. Welcome down, to Jack. Down, down. <laughs> I'm Johnny Knoxville, and this is talking to a girl that's a minor. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I'm Bam Margera. Hey, I'm Bam Margera. And we're going to be fucking this is, kids this is all day. Stings. Yeah. I'm Bam Margera. We're going to be fucking kids all day. Yeah, there it is. I don't care. If you look a little older, the better it is, my friend. This is like an REM music video. Well, that's yeah. me in the corner. Like, it looks like at some point he's going to start singing along with the music, like, you know. Yeah, it looks up. He's half in and out, yeah. He's super artistic. I'm so nervous. We're going to have the ultimate decoy in the studio. Why? You got some dirt on you, dude? No, I'm just excited. I love. I think he's fucking nuts. Do you get nervous when one of the voice guys steps in the room? Oh, like, ruff, ruff. Dan, down. You do voices. He does voices. Good, he goes, a lot, a lot of people tell me that I'm, they call me the, the white Michael Winslow. I go, what, what did you say? I'm sorry, what did you... What'd you say? He goes, hey, I'm telling you. I go, I, 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 do, I do danger field. I do danger field. You can't do danger field. Richie Ragu, who is that guy? Basta Bajuts. Yeah, the Bajuts. All right. So, well, I don't think uh, British... Rest easy, Ultimate Decoy. This British Columbian guy doesn't have jack shit on you. Production values. Oh, no. Toilet. No, not even so. Not of. even a good voice. But I wonder if, like, is Shane Coyle the godfather of this? I mean, obviously, the godfather is going to be Chris Hansen. But I yeah, mean, as far as doing it yourself... Let's ask what, what, is, what is Chris Hansen's influence on Shane he goes, Coyle? Dude, pedophile Hunter Mount Rushmore. Go. I go, put it up there. <laughs> pedophile Hunter Mount Rushmore, who's up there? Hanson, obviously. He's the Beatles of Pedophile uh, yeah, Hunter. Yeah, Hanson's definitely up there, he was dude. A, it was for eight years, and he fucking changed oh, the game. Oh, that guy's the G-dub, man. Yeah, he's the original. I go second, probably on Mount Rushmore of Pedophile Hunters. I gotta go Shane Coyle. I gotta, Shane, go, the ulti- gonna I gotta go the ultimate decoy. And some British Columbia fucking house painter. Yeah, good the- job. <laughs> hey, finish the edges. And, uh, <laughs> fucking paint tape over here. <laughs> Old hey, frog, blue, hey, blue frog, tape. Ta- frog tape teddy. Yeah. Dude, who else is on there? And of course, Feld Dog. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, what childhood? We... Oh, man. Hey, Tex, how you doing? I'm so excited. (laughs) Hey, Tex, how you doing? Chris Hansen, it'd be great if... Black, what are your thoughts? I just spoke to him. He said he's running about 10 minutes late. Just a heads up. That's fine. What if he big times us? You think? Oh, that's fine. That No, well, then... No, he's not going to big time us. Do you want to watch the... He's excited to come on the show. Do you want to... Have you spoke to him yet? Mm Mm-hmm. Voice to voice. Is voice to voice. Yep, that's him. Really? He's, yep. That's pretty. And he's excited to come on. He's excited. Nice. We're going to do the Liam Gallagher thing, and then we'll take a break, and we'll be back with Shane Coyle. What if the ultimate prank is Shane Coyle's not coming? I. That's what I think. He. Mm. What if he ultimate decoyed Lou? He ultimate decoyed you, Lou. You got decoyed. Not at all. That's my boy now. Oh. Dude, he decoyed you hard, bro. <laughs> just like, uh, just like Sean Fury. Well, oh, he lives in Jersey. Yeah. Are you going to go? Black Lou, hmm? you should go on a, a pedophile sting ride along soon. That would be fun. You live in Jersey too. Hell yeah! Film oh, a. Yeah. Pe- oh, oh my yeah, God, it, dude. It's Black all Lou fun, involved. It's all fun yeah. and games until the local Black Lou. and DJ Lou. No, please, yes. Please. DJ Lou and Black, you guys got to go on a ride along together. Hey, Buzz, get hammered and then go. <laughs> Blackout. It's like you fuck kids, man. You Just fuck kids. Right goes, the background you see Shane Kua goes. Bro, what are you gonna lie to me right now and say you thought that girl was eighteen? And then in the background you just see Black Lou pissing and go, ah. Yeah. <laughs> the or it's, throwback. It's only a two seater. Ah. It's only a two seater. So you see one of their faces poke out <laughs> between the seat and the car. They go, "You fuck kids, dude. You're gross. You're gross. You're fucking gross, man. You're a gross loser." If we could organize that when he comes in here, would you guys go on a ride along with him? In a heartbeat. On a pedophile sting. Please don't get oh, shot by local police, Black Lou, because I know he's stirring shit up, and I don't need them showing up being like, "What's happening?" No, when it, when everyone's talking, yelling the word pedophile and this group shows up they're oh. definitely gonna think it's dj lou yeah yeah <laughs> dj lou probably will just get tackled he'll get double leg takedown put on his puerto rican disco shirts trying yeah. to lure in these young girls he goes what what i thought young girls no class <laughs> some of the bitches didn't teach him that child predatorial nature is wrong they, and now i'm starting to think I maybe, know! He's a, maybe he's a female to male I transition know! i thought is he here Oh, Black Lou. Oh, Black Lou. He's yeah. getting broken up with on the phone right yeah. now. He goes, no, no, no. It's cool, man. I guess another time. I want right. to love you. Yeah. I want to love you so bad, but I he can't, goes, baby. Baby. I want to, <laughs> baby, <laughs> but I can't. I love you too much is it, what it is. It burns me up. up. Oh, what are you oh, doing? my baby. Go in another room. Oh, Go in another room. Oh, well, baby, I Face too time. much. FaceTime me. What are you wearing? <laughs> this British Columbia guy stinks. Yeah, I really He's do. nothing like Shane Coyle. Shane can be as late as he wants. Yeah, we'll, we'll extend it. We'll I, hope he comes, I hope he comes here with a guy in fucking like plastic, you know, the plastic handcuffs. He goes, sorry, he goes, sorry, guys. He I goes, got I one caught stairs. one. I, caught, I dressed up as a as a tiny Elmo. <laughs> He's on the perp walk with him yeah. through his tour. He goes, how you doing? So now I gotta do a press tour. You fucking mama chooch. You gonna, gonna make be, me take you to a press tour? This is my national syndication. Can you put Roger, just some name of a pedophile, like, on the guest list, please? Yeah, dude, there's so many questions I have. Shane. Yeah, convict 97. I got a million questions. I got no questions. I told you. Um, but he's going to get in here. We're going to have a fucking... It's going to be a good time. We're I mean, getting the drop on Dr. Voice, Phil. Dude. He's going to do the voice. We're getting it's the drop be... on Dr. Phil. Does anyone realize that? So great. Yeah, we got Second the drop time. on him. Second time we got it. We got it with Amber. What was her name? Autumn Rowe. Autumn Rowe. Yeah. I hope we have a... At the end of the day, I hope we have a legitimate, realistic drop of Shane Quill going like, yo, was that what Dr. Photo was? That shit was trash. <laughs> just like two people saying that. Yeah, go, Why is my huh? Dr. Phil? It's I'll, a good Dr. Phil. I, I mean, I know There's it's, so much scrutiny. It's definitely SNL worthy. That yeah. was trash. I don't understand. That was trash. That was trash. Dude, that that'd be trash. great if Dr. Phil called us. He goes, hey, is there some sort of problem? Y'all are <laughs> scooping my guests. Should we take a break? Now, we just cleared out the house. Yeah, we cleared all our ads. He's looking for parking. Okay, so we have a, we have our long break, though. Yes. That's fantastic. All right, so let's take the break. We'll come back, and then it's just Shane Coyle till the end. And then we got to go to Bennington Thanksgiving. Yeah. Yeah. We might have to kick out five minutes. No. We're going to have fun. We're coming back. We might have to go late. With Shane Coyle. We can't go late. I know. We got to get over. Damn it's it. Insane. I wish he was on time. I know. Um, it's okay. He's looking for parking. That's going to be probably, it's going to take a couple seconds. Where we're at, we're just in Rockefeller Center, the epicenter of the entire universe in New York City. I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm sure you're going to find parking. I'm not going to freak out. No, no, I'm no. I'm just going to find no, parking. No, it's no just problem. Midtown in uh, holiday season in, uh, you know, right by Radio City. Where it's right. just, you know, they're putting the tree up and everything. It's fine. He's going to find parking. He's fine. Yeah, he's downstairs. He's down. He's outside. He's outside. He just needs to come into the lobby. He's already got hey! parking. He parked. Right here. He parked. Oh, he parked. He's still in his car. Yeah. Oh, what's he doing? Ripping a dube. Yeah. 
I get it. Um, oh, no, he's drug-free. 99 days. 99 days clean, which we should congratulate. Yeah, absolutely. That's tomorrow's 100 days. It's got to be a big deal. I've never been like a... Well, I have a cigarettes, I guess. I've yeah. celebrated it like that. But I feel like drugs, man. Like cigarettes, what it's taking away is like a habit. If it's drugs that get you somewhere, like not having that change of emotion thing. Yeah. Is a big oh, dude, deal. and dropping off. I mean, 99 days is no bullshit. I yeah. Mean, not, you, know, you get 90 days, and it's basically like you're through the thick of it, but still got to work on it. Well, it's not pushing back to the junk. I don't yeah. ever want to do that for anybody. And I no. believe Shane Coyle is trying to do good in the world. Well, I just wish I believe so, him. I have so many questions for him that I want. I want well, to let's get him when we come back, and we're going to ride it out. When we come back, we'll take as long as we can uh, with our guest Shane Coyle. We'll be right back. Just vamping right now, waiting for Shane to come in. The ultimate decoy would be not coming in. It really would. You think he's not coming. I would plug him. B Rod's got the vote. He's not coming. Why are you? Why are you being all sad, B Rod? Oh yeah, this is Loki for sure. No, this is Guar. He's fighting people in his car. He's not coming up. Yeah. No. What's he going to abandon his car here? No, he was parked. I think. Oh, so Black Lou didn't know if he was parked. He said he He was was parked still in his car, but he's he might not be parked. He's parked right out front of the office building. Which means he's definitely not parked. He's not coming up. There's no way. He goes, these guys, them. these guys are bad guys. He's live streaming right now about us. These I'll guys are not good guys. Full, disclo- full disclosure, me and Dan are so new to interviewing people we don't know that we're both nervous and kind of okay if he just fucks us over and doesn't come in. We're like, okay. <laughs> the, the hallmark really sign. Is such a real thing. The hallmark when he comes in, we're both like, Dan, I hope you have things you want to say. Are you going to start? Or should I start? Yeah. I don't know what's happening. What's happening? <laughs> no, man. It is one of those things where he comes in, we're going to be like, it's very nice to meet you. Yeah. Hey, you... One of my pedophile. Fa- one, I, of my, one of my favorite video. Moments. British Columbia guy. Yeah. Jacob, your thoughts? Jacob. Well, no, I have an update on Shane. What's he, that? He went to the wrong building, so now he's fifty uh, fourth Street. So he's running down now. No, I mean, at this point, we're, we're going to eke him in. It doesn't make sense now. It's well, just... I mean, he's he's going to be he's going he's coming. We're going to have fifteen minutes. Uh, it's with like him. A I weird... mean, Lou gave him the address three times. I understand, but I'm saying I don't know what we're... I mean, have him come in, I guess, but this is like... We, now it sucks, because like... Yeah, we don't even get to get to him. I mean, it's fucking by time, it's 35 It's 54. By the time he gets over here, checks him with security, elevate, he's no, we not going to be here leave. for 10 minutes. We have to leave at 8 o'clock. Does he know that the show ends at 8? Does he know you're scheduled at 7? This is yeah. this is immediately... Oh, yeah. I mean, I was excited, and now I'm fucking mad. We've been decoyed. God damn it, we got decoyed. I knew it. <laughs> so wait Becky, a second. What do you are you really this, a child? Did you, you decoy this, saying that you were an adult that's married? What do you think this tattoo means? I got this tattoo. You think it doesn't mean Tud? Oh, his no. Nickname? That's not his nickname for you. The ultimate decoy. Um, we had so many plans. I I mean, it says 1221 Avenue of the Americas, 6th Avenue between 48th and 49th. Yeah, got it. we got to reschedule. We're going to have to tell Black Louie's going to have to give him the bad news. There's no... Why would we... Do, it, it's going to go nowhere. Yeah. We're going to have to reschedule this. Okay. He's way too late. Yeah, dude, His it's 30, timing it, was incredible. Well, I, <laughs> but here's the thing: I want to have <laughs> Scott. Yeah, that was great. Jacob, Jacob, let him know. I, I, we want to have him on. I certainly want to reschedule. But I, I want to fucking talk to the guy. But we can't. We'll be cramming it in and looking at the clock the whole time. So we have to go. Bennington's got us on. Yeah, we got. The, we're, we're doing Thanksgiving. We're doing tonight. Bennington Thanksgiving tonight. So we, we can't take him on that. We and we're and we're making Ron and them wait for us. Yes. Also, yes, they're waiting for us to get there. So I mean, come on, man. It's already thirty-five minutes. Come on, man. Been 45 minutes late for an hour interview. I was turning around hoping to see it say 25. And I was like, maybe we can get it in. If he's here by 35, we'll have 25 minutes of questions. It's just do that still. Even that would be not enough time, dude. We have so many. We want to do the the voices Hold on, hold on, hold on. We definitely need to watch the live stream because he'll lose his shit if he drove into the city. It has to go back to Jersey. How's that? 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 I'm not saying it's it's sort sort of our fault. I'm not saying. I mean, listen. Dude, if you show up 35 minutes late to a radio show that goes to 8 o'clock... Uh, listen, open door invite to Shane Coyle, but you got to give us the hour with you. you got to get here on time. It's just there's not enough time. He, he would come in here, and he could probably just promote his prank phone calls and then be out of here. It's, that's not even what we want to talk to him I'll about. give him all the promotions he was supposed to have today. Uh, the prank, Shane Coyle's Prank Mafia, the ultimate decoy on Facebook. <laughs> he does uh, personalized prank calls live nightly on Facebook. He's going to be on Dr. Phil. Oh, he's filming it December 13th. Ah, 14th. that's where we talk shit and Dr. Phil fucking made his cronies show up late. I mean, I'll give him all of his due here because I, 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 I want to have this guy on, but I now we're cramming it in. This is like less yeah. than, a, it, it's less than one segment of the show. That if he trash. gets here yeah, it now, was trash. he's still not, you know, it's just no way. He could walk in right now and I feel like we wouldn't have enough time. We wouldn't have enough time if he walked in right now. 
We have under. We have like twenty minutes. He told us he's a transgender. <laughs> Yeah, before anything else, we decoy even, related, he told he said he's transgender. You understand, radio wise, we had the table set for a prime rib meal with like all the accoutrements and candles, and then now those candles went down to those little nubs and they're still burning, and just we're just waiting there. We got ultimate decoy. The fucking pizza got cold. We got a, we got ultimate decoy. We fucking were Rosie Perez, dude. Yeah, we fucking white man can't jump. The stooky button's gonna. Fucking pieces all cold. Stop it. When I say I want a glass of water, I want you to say I have been thirsty too. Three hours, Billy. Billy. Three hours. <laughs> Fucking pieces all cold. It's Wine's perfect. warm. Perfect. Thank you. Becky came up specifically for this. I'm sorry, Beck. I'm sorry you had to listen to a hilarious show, mm. Becky. <laughs> yeah, sorry you learned about it. of apologies. Sorry, you're your Shane Coyle oh, pictures. Oh, smoke weed with your buddies and sit here and laugh at day evil. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to drag you away from yeah, we, uh, man, we got Gary. Yeah. I know, I this, mean, I know uh, this feeling. It's, 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 we're now we're down the under 20 minutes. No, we got Gary dead. dead. Yeah, well, I tell you, bringing him, in now, bringing him now is a problem. We, we, we have to end off. We don't get anything out. We don't get to anything fun or ride anything out at all in 20 minutes. This sucks. Look at your face. You're so sad. I like, I like Dave Evil, but this sucks. Hey, can I cheer you up? Yeah. You know, somewhere in the world right now, I believe outside of Patterson, New Jersey, Pussy's going for forty dollars. Forty? Forty dollars? Um, who was it? Somebody was asking me about the, who the you know the predator to catch a predator videos that people do on their own. Yeah. And which we were going to have, we had a topic today. It ties right into it. Of uh, Josh Adam Myers sent me a video. I ended up seeing it on World Star Hip Hop, but Josh Adam Myers sent me uh, this video of. For the first time, you see somebody trying to get stopped by the predator hunters, pedophile hunters, and they have the wrong person. And he's right. completely confused by the whole thing, but it's a weird conversation. But also to find out, and did you watch it at all, the Shane Coyle thing, Dan? No, I was watching the game. Did anybody watch it, the video I sent? I saw you texting me, and I was like, oh, it's a Shane Coyle video. So I reacted like, oh, yeah. cool, but I, I wasn't going to stop game seven. Now, we Shane were, Coyle. No, sure, we we're get it. turning it around. Shane Coyle. Uh, the ultimate decoy. Who, uh, who, has blew, who decoyed us. Yeah, he de totally decoyed us. He has retired from ultimate decoying. He has given it up the job because it's become too perverted by people uh, who come into it to do the wrong thing. He said he started training people where they were, they were following him and his lead. Yeah. What he does. Sensei Shane. Uh, yeah. And then he would, uh, they would go out, and instead of actually trying to get the cops involved, or, or, or what he believed, you know, he believes he was doing, like, the Lord's work yeah, in, in helping this out. He goes, these guys were straight up, they would go up, and they'd be like, you're a pedophile, and I'm here to catch you. I'm, I'm the girl you were talking to, or whatever. And then they'd go, oh, my God, oh, my God, I'm in trouble. And he goes, give me a couple hundred bucks out of the ATM, and we'll call it a day. Oh, dude, people just started using it as a shakedown? Immediate, immediate extortions, yeah. And if you could play, you have that video, Christine? Oh, man. I, I mean, it makes sense that you say that. That makes sense. You know what I mean? When, when Shane oh. Cole's like, they've used my martial arts for evil. And you're like, well, yeah, because they have something over somebody that is the worst. It, dude, he looks crazy. Wow. What did he do? Did he get facial surgery? Why does he look like a ventriloquist doll? I don't know. He does. <laughs> Fucking looks like Eddie Munster grew up. Yeah, they go. And right here is Mr. Pockets, who was on the road with Eddie Salzabo for 40 years. <laughs> As when, I first got, when I first got into the Gambino family. Yeah, but look at, no, he looks like, hey, everyone, hey, kids. Hey, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. He was on the Chitlin, he, uh, he was on the black and tan circuit. I mean, splinters. <laughs> yeah. Hey, it's Woodsy. I was on the, the I was on the Borscht Belt for over 15, weird, weird. Dude, this yep. guy. Christine, let the video you, play. Let me tell you my judgment before you play this video of Shane Coyle. And this I is didn't see him talk yet. On he's on Doctor Phil. I just watched the intro of him on Doctor Phil, not him actual talking. So this is very exciting for me. He has when we found out that he was on from G to Gent, uh huh. And then we found out he did this this pedophile shit. It's yeah. pretty obvious to me that Shane Coyle just really wants to be famous. This he motherfucker likes being on television just wants to be on TV. So that this makes sense. That I would. I mean, dude, I would love to interview some of the people that he's thrown under the bus to be like. Are you extorting? Did he teach you to extort? I mean, where, where does the extortion come in? You know what I mean? Yeah, well, he, 
he this is from December 2019, so that means right. he, said, he said he'd been quit for two and a half months. So he technically quit like last October. Man, and I bet um, I bet COVID is just pedo hunting season. All man, those I bet. I those bet. meetups and masks. All right, but, uh, but I saw this intro, but I did not see him talk on Doctor Phil, which is going to be just fantastic, I believe. Check this out, parents. My name is Shane Coyle. You can subscribe yeah. to my page after tonight and get exclusive content of me exposing these child predators. I'm the one Pause that jump started this Pause child it. predator. By the way, also that's a subscribe so you can get exclusive uh, stuff of me getting predators. Goes, now make sure you sign up or I'm not going to show you who the predators you name are. <laughs> Go sign up for my Patreon or your kid's going to get sucked off by someone yeah. very close well, I'm gonna to tell, I'm going to tell him where your kid lives and what his schedule is. I'm flipping the script. I'm putting out school schedules to all these guys that I know and known monsters. Unless you sign up right now, link uh, links in the description below. Yeah, find out the Patreon. Find out what to do when you think your kid is being attacked by a predator and he has water in his ear from the pool. Yeah. It's a different situation. <laughs> Five ninety nine. I can teach you how to get out of that little jam. That balance is off. Unless you yeah. sign up. Equilibrium lets your kid get fucked. You better you get a free you sticker. Do. You get a sticker with the one tear. <laughs> yeah. Content of me exposing these child predators. I'm the one that jump-started this child predator movement in the United States. You know, this not, movement is not, 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 not Chris Hansen? <laughs> not Chris Hansen, the guy that got fucked, that had multiple Dateline specials about it. Also, rewind it, because the way he said that, it sounds like he was like, I was the one who started pedophilia in the United States. <laughs> <laughs> The one that jump started this child predator movement in the United States. Dude, it comes off like he's like, I was the first one that said, Yo, why ain't no one fucking these kids? No, <laughs> these kids are you know, untapped pussy, man. It's the, the wave of the future. It's gonna change the world, dog. Yo, you ever have a girl and be like, Yo, you too tight? And then I was like, Ding. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, ding, ding, ding. Who's Yo. always tight? My eureka, <laughs> my eureka moment was at a ball pit at a play pace. <laughs> like, We've driven movement and it needs to stop. I was definitely the first one to create the content that you see, the dialogue that they use. Hey, where are you? I'm right with the public, baby. I could sound like a little girl and there's no decoys. So where are you? I've done all 176 busts in several different states. Out of all of these child predator busts, no convictions. Everything that is being glorified online about exposing child predators is wrong. Yeah, because he's he basically just said the stat that means the most. He goes seventy six busts, uh, zero convictions, couple, couple tickets, and a guys some guys that shook off some embarrassment in a parking lot. Yeah, because you're just a whack off, dude. You can't. Yeah, that's it. Like it, nobody. You hope that nobody finds the videos of... It's the only stat you know for sure is 76, uh, 76 catches, 76 guys driving home, pounding the steering wheel like this. Fuck, 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 fuck. Just uh, hitting the steering wheel. At, at most, fuck, lost fuck, their fuck, family. Fuck, fuck. At most, fuck. lost their family. Nah, probably, probably, did not, they probably didn't even lose their trucking job. The truckers, a single trucker, it, it, it didn't even break his stride. Yeah, he, he probably he tells people those, about it. He goes, "Oh, you see, I'm on, a, I'm on a YouTube video." Dude, he got those cases of oranges to West Virginia and he just fucking shared that clip. <laughs> yeah, he delivered he looks, that old spice. I will say, Shane Coyle looks like he's been fucking. He's been eating some iron breakfasts. He looks yeah, he's packing them on. He's packing them on. I was saying he's, he looks. He looks diesel, dude. Oh, you think so? I think he looks just like heavy. He has, he's getting like. Uh, he looks like daddish now, and he was always so like a uh, wiggery. Yeah, I I don't know if it's the shirts. I don't know if he's just been fucking locking out sets. <laughs> Jesse, Tony, Josh, these guys were trained by me. All of these guys are copying everything that I did, but these idiots went wild, man. Like, I'm talking crazy. I gave Tony the nickname Phony Blah. He just started extorting predators. Phony Blah. And by the way, it, looks, like good uh, it, looks, it looks like if I decided to become a pedophile. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dude, that's is button up. Is is button ups now part of the job? Did he put in a dress code? I, I think you got to. Fucking... Yeah, you have to employ a dress code. You can't go no more affliction T-shirts. By the way, you can't dress like wait. Scott Seth Green from Can't Hardly Wait. No, but dude, phony blah. By the way, has the blousiest sleeves I've ever seen on a dress shirt. My God, they look like curtains. I mean, that thing is like a. There's a play happening under those things. <laughs> <laughs> 
phony blah. He just started extorting predators. There was one bus, it was a 70-something year old man there to meet a little girl. He took him to the ATM and got a few hundred bucks out of this old guy and released him, let him go. I see a lot of myself in Jesse. Jesse got lost in the fame and the hate. This is so wrong what they're still doing because there's no police involvement. I stopped hunting these child predators nearly two and a half months ago when I almost lost my life. You're here to meet somebody, correct? Do you want to know who I am? I'm the that's exposing you as a child predator. He went to leave, came back around full speed and crashed into me. Go ahead, run me over, boy. Go ahead, come on. <laughs> I seen my kids' faces literally in those headlights and enough's enough <laughs> come on hit me bro what are you gonna do Romeo? Oh, 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 wow but it, when it gets close enough he goes stop 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 dude and how did you not think that one of these guys was going to try to hit you with their car you don't fucking think <laughs> you think they just so go like true. you know what man lesson learned i'm not definitely crazy enough to do something he's like i woke up in the hospital and i thought i was a little girl for like two months I was stuck in the voice. <laughs> Apparently, when this dude smashed into me, my brain <laughs> stuck me in that voice. It so I got all these guys. It became little Jill. So anyways, six months after being in the first grade, I snap out <laughs> of it. It's so I'm doing me. the Billy Madison thing. I'm zooming through. <laughs> <laughs> boom, bop, bada, bing, bada, boom. I'm picking up my ABCs. I'm learning my two plus twos. Yeah. All of a sudden, come to gym class, I snap out of it. I'm like, what the fuck <laughs> am I doing here? Why am I in this little boy's lugger room? <laughs> Why am I wearing these Superman underpants that are so tight on my schwans? <laughs> I'm wondering why I got these shit-stained Batman underwear on, and I realized, I oh, my I, God, I've been living as a fucking nine-year-old. Oh, my God, I can't believe I've been a little girl this whole time. Oh, it's my me. God. It's Shane. Turns out, it's Shane Cool. It turns out I'm not afraid of the basement. Just the stairs get very dark. <laughs> I'm Shane Coyle. I'm an adult. <laughs> I'm Shane Coyle. I've been an adult this whole time. You I'm guys let me walk around in a dress and pigtails. <laughs> what are you talking about? I, I had a system in my car. A Mr. Week Coyle, ago. If, Mr. Coyle, if we hit you with the reality, there's no way of telling what kind of irreparable damage could have been done to your psyche. No, I get it, Doc. You let me live as Jennifer for a little while. Why you make me put on the panties, though? Appreciate the, appreciate the kid gloves, Doc. Uh, <laughs> I, not for nothing, I am going to miss combing the hair of plastic horses. Yeah. It was something that I found really leveled me <laughs> off at the end of the day. Can I take this little blanket home? I like <laughs> it. Quick question, that Polly Pocket, what are you going to do with it? Throw it out? <laughs> I mean, I already got my masculinity all over it. <laughs> he goes, Listen, me, I take it home. Ain't not for nothing. You were a good dad to a seven-year-old girl for a week. I didn't know you did that well, but you seem a good guy. You ain't no predator, huh? I ain't going to catch you. All right, get out all of here. All right. Um, yeah, you, Shane Coyle started a fucking movement that he... And now he hates that he's a, a part of the thing that's just people swindling people. <laughs> yeah, they go, oh, you want to fuck kids? Give me $100. And you go, da. Uh, by the way, and the, by the way, I don't know if you see the next clip available when this is over. Just so it says, ex-cop to pedophile hunters. There's no law enforcement, dot, dot, dot. It's certainly going to say that will support your crazy fucking one man. Dude, one man vigilante case. People think they have it because they have a YouTube channel that could be vigilantes. It's nuts. He's like, here's all the evidence you need. He goes, ah, I need a little more than that. And he goes, I don't know, messages on your phone saying I want to suck your pussy. I don't know if that puts this guy away. <laughs> no, it was me, Jennifer. Hey? He goes, the cop's like, I recognize that voice. He does the into his, into his thing. He goes, I'm going to need some backup. What the yeah, hell yeah. is this guy? Yeah, bat shit lunatic over here talking in a girl voice. I am, yeah, I talk like this on the phone. Screaming to me at this 75-year-old trucker is a pedophile. Yeah, all right. All right. He's wearing sunglasses at night. He's... Uh, um, let's watch the end of this clip. Oh, yeah. It's got 1.1 million views. 1. Oh, yeah. Damn. I've done 500,000 last night. <laughs> I've seen my kids' faces literally in those headlights. And enough's enough. If there's anything that I can say to these guys, look, man, it's got to stop. Cut. He's got the most expressive eyebrows. Okay. Okay. So, you have never actually caught a pedophile. 
Dan, is that your Dan? Is that your Dr. Phil impression? Nope, that was my <laughs> chain coil. So suck my dick. No, Curve I like ball. it. I like the impression, but let me let's go to the uh, phone lines. What do people think about it? Damn it! Ah, uh, that was trash. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Witsky. I saw you say that. That was even the phone line. Um, come on. How, how would you catch me if, if I was a predator? Would you catch me? How would you? Would you cover yourself in mud? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then when I walked up, did you talk to me in the girl voice? When I slowly walked up to you, would you go, "What the hell are you?" <laughs> I'd go, "My name's Doctor Phil." Dude, he looks like a Jim Henson puppet. It looks weird as shit. Shane Coyle, I, his eyebrows. They, they really, he moves his face like Hoggle from Labyrinth. Can't say what you will, but I'll buy a spray tan from that guy any day. It's too bad. You can't do it. It's not how you crazy. You don't do pedophiles like that. You don't want to do that. It's got to stop. <laughs> See? Sick at it. Okay, <laughs> Shane, thank you for being here. Thank you for having me. Um, I really appreciate it. <clears throat> You're here today to tell these three guests something. What is it? It's madness. It's insane. Nobody is saving children. We're basically fueling our own vendettas against these, without explicit language, these predators, okay? Each and every single one of us that has done this has done the wrong thing. And I'm one of the worst ones out there because I was high 90% of the time and I have accountability. And I know that I started it with a true passion in my heart, but that heart... Pause it. Hold on. He was high high the whole time? He glazed over that really fast. Of course he was, dude. He was whacked out. Number two. Driving around a fucking Walmart trying to catch a fucking truck driver. He got... So he got sober. That's what happened. He got sober. And then he was like... Oh, I just realized I'm not like doing anything. I'm just making a weird scene in a Walmart. You want to know how good Enrique's blow is? I tracked <laughs> this guy down for trying to fuck a nine-year-old girl. I did the voice and everything. I was fucking whacked out of my goddamn board. Yo, he had good stuff, though. I mean, it made it, the was, moment. Was, it felt like I was changing the world. I was ripping three fucking packs of Salem's, <laughs> chasing down these goddamn monsters. Cocaine will make you challenge a car. Yeah, dude. That's what <laughs> Give me, bro. I want it. <laughs> <laughs> I can walk through steel, for I am the return of glory. I am the return of justice. Yeah, I hope that's not some fiberglass import shit, because I'm going to fucking split that thing in two. <laughs> I fucking ate a Saturn for lunch. Come get some. <laughs> he goes, oh, it was me. Oh. <laughs> Before 1990 craftsmanship, that's steel. Yeah, that's yeah. metal. Oh, oh man, God damn it, that was sheet metal. All of it. Oh God. Oh, that's American made. This guy last Boy Scouted me. <laughs> oh, he smashed my femurs. You think if you dropped him in a in a thing of lava, Shane Coyle, he starts like keeps coming up as like a different like he's a little girl. Oh, T1000. That he's a G. Ah! That he's, yeah, that he's a G from Jen. <laughs> and then he's and then he's the grandma that's like get off the phone. Oh, get off the phone. You're five. Oh, no, no. Remember, he's like five minutes away. Yeah. <laughs> five minutes away. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, yeah. Demon Lord Ozark, what do you think? It's all his characters. Okay, so what I'm seeing here is you have a severe, you are obviously possessed, and I would say this is a 14th gothic demon. Yeah, found that after I go to the hospital for that car thing, I got disassociative personality disorder. <laughs> Turns out I'm borderline this whole time. I wasn't on my meds. <laughs> what we're doing is wrong. We're doing it to feed our own vendettas. Or to finally live your life as that little girl you've been dreaming about. Uh, also, I found an old box buried in a field, and I opened it, and an emulet put four different voices in my head. <laughs> Okay, yeah, you were possessed by what we call a 14th century brain fuck. I've seen <laughs> yeah. this before. A lot of people don't know this. I also hunt vampires. <laughs> he goes, that's classic Wendingo. Oh, you right there. That's what we call a brain suck from Haiti. That's a simple Haitian voodoo spell. <laughs> Please play the rest of this. Twisted. The second money, fame, likes, shares, all of that stuff got involved. And it needs to stop because nobody's getting arrested. And if they are arrested, look at the numbers. They don't weigh out. You were in a parking lot and, and some guy, you know, in his car, he speeds off. Then he turns around and you say, yeah, you want to run over me? Go right ahead. 
Were you high then? Absolutely. Yeah. Let, let's take a <laughs> look. He goes, he goes, dude, you're awesome. I like that. Can you, Lou, please let's rewind it, Christine, and get get clean. Like, were you high then? Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> absolutely. Oh, absolutely. I think Just I Just the whole, the whole question. I think I, did a bump, I think I did a bump off my knuckle when he was revving. <laughs> I tried to Kobe Bryant the fucking thing and jump over. <laughs> The numbers, they don't weigh out. You were in a parking lot, and and some guy, you know, in his car, he speeds off. Then he turns around, and you say, yeah, co you want to run over me? Go right ahead. Were you high then? Absolutely. Let, let's take a closer look at, at that. <laughs> Dude, this is fucking nuts. That's a great trade-off of lines right there. Were you high then? Absolutely. Let's take a look at that. <laughs> he goes, oh, man, I want to see you like a cat. I'm testing your skills on that one, Lou. That will fall in somewhere perfectly one day, though. Oh, absolutely. Were you high then? Absolutely. Well, let's take a look at that. <laughs> Go ahead. Come on. Oh, no. You say, run Dude. me over, boy. Go ahead. He, said, he goes, oh, I bro. felt nothing. <laughs> Dude, the best is his reaction is, oh, bro. He goes, oh, bro, that was mean. Yeah. Dude, you did it. You actually did it. You say, run me over, boy, go ahead. And he said, okay, he ran you over. <laughs> you go, Man, this guy. That was my last one. But it's, it's something like that that can happen every single time. The cops are the ones that need to do this. So how badly were you hurt? I ripped my rotator. I exaggerated it a little bit, too. Remember, Dr. Phil, I said it was high. I, told, yeah. I said, oh, there's a bone sticking out. I mean, likes, views, shares. It really was. Well, Shane's unique <clears throat> talent like of mimicking. That guy was like, dude, you're not ruining my... Th I get so much money off exposing yeah, like, these pervs. He's like, I'm going to hit Dr. Phillip for about 15K when I get out of here. He goes, I, I probably can hit him with a voice. Get him on the yeah, phone. Yeah, yeah. He goes, hey, uh, I want to say hi to you before the show. He goes, I'm just a naked girl in here. What, do you want to have sex with me? <laughs> yes. uh, uh, no. no, I thought my guest was in here. Uh, my, my producer, Lisa, told me that... Uh, Pedophile Hunter was in here. Am I wrong? It's just me and what? You want to finger me? Why don't you get uh, $15,000 and stay under the door and I won't tell anybody? I'm going to be right back. And then, then, you just, then the money just slides under. <laughs> <laughs> My uh, favorite to cash. Um, do you do CODs? <laughs> And girl's voice was so convincing to one alleged child predator that Shane convinced him to do something. Well, Jerk off. Tattoo. Take There's it. a tattoo one for <laughs> this sure. This one's good. This one, oh, go back. Go back. Dude, yeah, let I me tell him. you something. He's still sucking his own dick. Yeah, yeah, right there he goes, oh, he goes, this one's fucking oh, yeah. this, He goes, this is the jam, bro. <laughs> right here. Oh, man. This is the best. This is the best one. By far, this is his best one. Convinced him to do something. Well, take a look. <laughs> this one's good. 58-year-old man trying to meet this 15-year-old female. Oh, and by the way, yeah, I think I convinced this man to get a tattoo of what he thinks is my nickname. He thinks the, fe fe he thinks the 15 year old female calls herself TUD, T-U-D. It's the, the ultimate decoy. <laughs> oh, wait. Let him do his voice. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt. That's rude. Voice log. He thinks the 15-year-old female calls herself Tud. T-U-D. So, will you get a tattoo with my name on it? I cried earlier. I was like, what? You promised me. I can't believe you did this. You didn't even do it. Are you going to do it? He said he would do it. So guess what? T-U-D should be on this man's arm. Okay? You don't make any sudden movements. You don't make any fast moves. Guy, if you make a sudden fast movement, okay. I'm going to defend myself. Okay? Okay? Uh -huh. Number one, you're here to meet somebody, correct, guy? Yeah. Okay, who are you here to meet? Uh, I think her name's... Um, you look a little shocked, uh, man. I, I am. I don't know what's going on. Can I take a look at your left arm? Yeah. What you got, man? Let me take a look. Don't make any sudden movements. We're fully aware, and I'm highly trained, bro. Highly trained, What's bro. What's that? Tuck. What is it? Utterly stupid. What is it? T-U-D. What's that stand for? Ultimate decoy. No, that stands for the ultimate decoy.
Oh, yeah. oh. little oh, thing called an acronym, God. friend. Are you familiar with acronyms? Yeah, to you That's did. how I get my guy. He goes, it's Tud. It's Utterly ex. stupid. By the way, I would never want to meet up with a girl whose nickname was Tud. <laughs> Dude, I don't know, man. If, it, if Tud had a big old pair of cans and a flat tummy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, Tud sucks off everybody in the apartment complex. Yeah. Tud, is, <laughs> Tud is built. That bitch built. <laughs> Tud. Yo, Tud. He goes, Duh. Uh, he goes, this one, he's a good one. Holy moly, they're playing my hits. <laughs> Dude, I didn't know those other ultimate decoy guys exist, and they just shake people down. I'd argue that part of my job is looking up black dick. That's fair, Christine. That's fair. <laughs> you don't have to remind us every day, though. <laughs> Dr. Phil's eyes are impossibly small. Wow, they really are. And they really are just two shirt buttons of eyes. Man, I've never noticed how tiny his eyes are. They are really small eyes. I'm 97% head, 3% He's, <laughs> He's bulging them, dude, but those are little pinpricks of eyes. He looks like a, a cartoon. Well, I'm joined by Jesse, Tony, and Josh, who are among the most it's active me, pedophile Andrew hunters Schultz. in the country. <laughs> in the situation. In the situation. Tony and Josh, who are among the most active pedophile hunters in the country right now. Funny I'm also block. joined by Shane, who despite claiming to have originated the phenomena, says these guys should leave the hunting to the professionals. Well, my next guest is in fact a former FBI detective, law enforcement officer, and chief criminal investigator who has done uh, a lot to of kids. the training. He's been through this for his entire career. This guy looks fun. Uh, <laughs> He's that, a guy looks, file. that guy looks a lot of fun. That guy looks like he really is down to take a Saturday off and just eat junk food. First of all, I want to say, sadly, I recognize Jennifer's voice up there, Shane. And uh, <laughs> I just want to say that you led me on. I thought we really had something. I was walking around at Walmart looking for you all night. <laughs> You said you were going to meet me at that Circle K, and it did not happen. His entire career. Uh, please welcome Steve Cardi. And Steve, thank you so much for being here. <laughs> Steve, first off, do you think they should be doing it or not? Uh, absolutely not, Dr. Phil. And why not? Well, <clears throat> there's no law enforcement agency in the country that wants you doing this nor wants to work with you because you're destroying their investigations. Police officers come on the job and they spend years before they're even considered for a job like this. It requires dedication, years of training, years of supervision. You're being watched very closely. You've got Yo, the Shane rule of Coyle's law. You've got the rule still of on drugs. You think so? Oh my God, he is twitching like a mo look at his face. He's like, mm -hmm. you know what? We start another business. We should start. Let's make pizza out of uh, broccoli. He goes, Doctor Phil. Doctor Phil, pizza. you're a real, you're a real doctor, right? I got these vitamin supplements that you would fucking, love. <laughs> you would fucking absolutely love them. You should take them because what they do is they actually make you feel like you're getting all the vegetables, that you, but you're not eating any vegetables, and that's the really the whole part of it. It's like gorilla juice. People like that because gorillas are big, and people like it big and big like gorillas. Can I smoke cigarettes in here? You ever use rhino <laughs> horn to have sex? Oh, man, I'll tell you right now. I really fucking, God damn it, it gets you going. It really, you can, you can fuck like a fucking champ on that one. Fuck <laughs> beast. Is it hot? Can I take my shirt off? God damn, are you guys sweating? Because these fucking lights, huh? He got a ring pop or something back there? Hmm. Sorry, I usually have a pacifier with me when I'm... Oh, my, oh, the sugar's good. Oh, it's calming me down. Okay. All right, where were we? very closely you've got the rule of law you've got the rule of evidence um you've got to prepare for the district attorney's office you've got to prepare to present it to a grand jury none of that can be accomplished <laughs> by what you're doing it's not going to help that he has a tattoo on his arm you fucking yeah. dudes he goes i listen you could be fucking red skeleton you could be <laughs> dana, dana fucking carvey i don't know <laughs> <laughs> Stop! You fucking up my caseload. You got the, the, all the guys have their own voice. He goes, he goes, I play Joel. I'm a nervous young boy who's ready to explore a man. I play Luke King. 
I am new to this country. <laughs> We're going to have to cancel you on that one. This is I don't is. say no to nothing. <laughs> yeah, I'm down for whatever. <laughs> <laughs> I'm what they call a two-input donkey. Yeah, oh, I suck and fuck. They go, you can't use that, dude. It's You're, you're canceled. You're canceled. <laughs> yeah. I'm, called, I'm what they call a fluid pig. Mm. That means I like to play all the water sports. My name is Candace Murphy. I'm a 13-year-old Irish guy. <laughs> <Please stop. laughs> What's happening up here, Please man? Stop. Please stop. And, uh, you know, as I'm watching what's going on here, I'm It's hot. I'm not telling you it's, it's hot. He goes, I can barely see anything. <laughs> I, honestly, movements, they, they fuck me up every time. Oh, man. Dude, you could cut all of his vision off with pennies. <laughs> pennies I, over his eyes. My ex-wife described my eyes as the eyes of a wombat. And <laughs> I understand what she was saying. I'm, I, I go off sonar. So when I'm talking, <laughs> yeah. I'm actually gauge in the room. Don't freak out if I feel your face yeah. when you walk up. My eyes are purely aesthetic. <laughs> I see through my gills. Yeah. I don't know if you know this, but I'm drawn like a Canadian at <laughs> South Park. <laughs> I have little just dot fries. Dude, his eyes are tiny. They're so bizarrely little. Dude, when does this guy's head turn from skin into hair? <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell. <laughs> Dude, it's just fucking... <laughs> <laughs> he, goes, <laughs> he goes, I forgot to shave. He goes, He's got uh, five o'clock head shadow. Oh, uh, yeah, dude. He's like, we call this haircut the sunset. That hair got tell you what, though. I'll give this guy some credit. Unless he put a little makeup on him, he does not have what I would expect to be sunglass tan on the side of his head. Yeah, no, he doesn't, and I would definitely think you'd see two tones on that. Me too. <laughs> Not like phony, you know, phony wa- blah. Yeah, phony blah. Phony blah is such a great name. Phony I want to hear him talk. Ooh, hey, everyone, I'm, I'm, phony, blah, blah. I'm, I'm who he calls phony blah. Hello, my name is phony blah. <laughs> That's his voice? Oh. <gasps> What if we dude, what, should we dude? start posing? Should we start posing as pedo? If a pedophile hunter ever caught me doing something, I'd go. Well, here's the thing: it goes I'm a pedophile hunter. Hunter, I yeah. was setting you up by pretending to be a pedophile to find out people who were scamming people for pedophiles. Ser- what? Ser- <laughs> Serpico, motherfucker! They put me <laughs> in to fucking find out who the bad guys are. I'm you a pedophile are, hunter. Hunter. <laughs> I, I hunt the hunted who are hunting. <laughs> Fuck, I don't know. Wait. What? He goes, well, what about the pedophiles themselves? He goes, they're not even in the equation here. <laughs> what are you talking about, man? Those, those cases will get tossed right out. You're talking to a fake uh, You're talking to a fake pedophile? I'm talking to a fake kid? Or just, we're just we're canceling each other out right now. It's all pretend, guy. Now. <laughs> yes. It's just YouTube vids, brah. Oh, yeah, brah. I'm just trying to get a TikTok following. Now, if my friend Skin Hairhead... Can you tell you what's if you can please let this. <laughs> oh, it's all white supremacy on the sides oh, and, milit- and militant dad on top. Man, this guy looks like the guy that screams at you before you go hunt big bugs on another planet. He goes, you guys can't hunt pedophiles. Leave them alone. There's too many. Yeah, hey, Starship Trooper Head. I don't feel like I'm going to get anything done right now. Hey, dedicated my whole life to whatever branch of the military I'm in. Hey, uh, <laughs> hey, climbed over that useless wall over 300 times. Yeah. I don't think you're going to get any better. Yeah, hey, four-star something whose wife does not really think it's pleasant when he's home. <laughs> yeah. Dude, this guy looks incapable of relaxing. I'm just saying, Judy, if I come home and the chicken's cold, reheated is all I'm saying. Please. Uh- I like I'm out a, there hunting pedophile hunters. I like a nice hearty stool. Uh, a hearty stool. I like a nice stool. That's our next topic. I like a nice hearty stew to be ready by 700 o'clock. Or 70, yeah, oh, 700. Oh, so you go, you eat stew in the morning? He goes, first things first, man. You get that beef in your bones. You got to get that beef in your bones. He goes, the gravy preserves me all day, and I'm out there hunting the hunters. When I return home at 1,800 hours, I like to have a nice, sensible grilled cheese and a soup, and then I sleep thinking about hunting. I drink a Tom Collins, I watch the evening news, and I hit the sack. I, I, I mix it with my index finger. I take a <laughs> sip, and I go, of course. <laughs> More pedophile hunters. They never end. 
doing. And, uh, you know, as I'm watching what's going on here, I'm concerned, and I don't mean to brag, but I'm not a lawyer. Uh, so I just look at this from a, a, a lay standpoint, but I'm thinking I, I'm concerned about what? entrapment. I'm concerned about the the chain of custody with evidence here. And when you go to these guys, uh, what is said and not said uh. may or may not fit the elements of the law of what needs to be done. How do you know Spirit what's the fuck out, of Jesus, it, 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 What is you doing? Did fucking did Shane Coyle slip you some blow? Why are you? Fucking? And um, you know, no, 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 no. you're gonna get there, and who's gonna have the uh, evidence on? Um, I'm not gonna lie. I can't stop staring at that woman in the fourth row with her legs open. Miss, can you do me a favor? You shut them. <laughs> yeah, my laser beam eyes are looking right at your chomps. Sorry, I got tunnel vision permanently because my <laughs> eyes are so sunken in my head. So if you could stop touching yourself, there are two perfect circles. He has cufflink eyes, dude. This. Me that so if you do it took side. one of these cases and it, and took this video and attempted to prosecute it, uh, a a halfway decent criminal defense lawyer would just blow it full of holes. Uh, the process with regard to what they're doing has more holes in it than Swiss cheese. Oh, roast law comic. enforcement can't work with them. They can't put a rubber stamp and say, you know, it's okay. Give us the stuff and we'll. It can't happen that way. It doesn't happen that way because law enforcement will find evidentiary problems. They're going to find that you probably have entrapped people. I mean, what is the training that your your decoys go under? Your, no, some of your decoys may hair even and all kinds be of shit sexual going on. Good gelled up hair, though. They may even be sexual. Shane Coyle is just like, question. Shane Coyle doesn't like hearing any of this. Watch his face right there. No, I think he likes it. I think he's agreeing with it because he's out. Now he wants everybody out. Decoys may even be Those sexual are... predators themselves. Whoa. Why, why is a, new a city school teacher arrested and nobody else? If law enforcement won't work with us, why is, is it that guy was arrested and none other? Because it's a public... Likely, he was arrested for violating his conditions, failure to report, but something other than what you did, except you turning him in. Failure to yeah. report that he wouldn't be in a school. Well, his school. point is... His point is, if we're going to leave it to law enforcement, why do they arrest this guy, but not these other 19 that were not as high profile? Because they're doing just as much damage as this guy. Why do they only want the collar that gets some ink and not these guys that are doing just all as right, much Dr. damage? Phil. That was told by the Damn, Dr. Dr. Phil going all the way to the top. These guys are clout chasing. I'm going to say it right now. Why is it that it's only, if it's on the front page, it's good news, but if it's on the second page, it's bad news? Why is that? If you guys are so lit, why is no one getting arrested? When y'all can fight, figure out an answer, let me know. I'm going to be on the back page looking at hookers and playing Sudoku. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to be doing a word hunt looking for the word cop because I don't see one here. I'm tiny eyes. I can focus right in. Uh.